Bro, is it actually in the darkness, son? Yeah. Where the fuck are you at, Sky? Are you in the fucking Matrix? What's going on? Holy shit. Nigga, I am in my room. Turn in the, the Matrix? Line, or the what? It, uh, can, uh, can we focus on someone else's camera? Damn. Black box. Just like draw so much. You're right in the middle of the whole Discord overlay, and you're just like a head just floating there. Oh, there you go. <laughs> now Dick's in the middle. Hey, what's up, Dick? How you doing? Good, man. How are you? Pretty good. How are you doing, Vito? Doing well. The duo here today. Wow. The unstoppable Wait. duo. Yeah, we I were told it was a partnership, it's... but I guess that's not I... happening. I know, Dick. Uh-oh. <laughs> I love you too, man. I, I, I haven't <laughs> talked to you in so long. It's been forever, I know. <laughs> Holy shit. The Justin Wang uh, house party, or uh, roof party. That shit was a <laughs> thing. Oh, I think that's where I met you, too. Mm -hmm. <coughs> God, that was like four years. That was pre-COVID. That was a long time ago. Actually, I yep. think that was during COVID because you needed to have, like, your shot to go into a show. Yeah. Oh, really? Oh, yeah. 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 Yep, 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 yep. What's up, Carantos? Maddox was at that, uh, no, the first night party. How long ago was this? Like four years ago. Yeah. Damn. It was? Yeah, there was like two. Oh, wait, there was two nights, and wasn't Maddox at one of them? I don't think so. Because I was that at was the second sad. night of the party, and I missed all the fun. Oh, that that was uh that I was just a remember, um, he, you were the one that got, uh, that was doing that protest. You were at the yeah. protest, and you got, uh. He got thrown Matt. into a. I got all the accolades, and Dick got his head They lied. They all lied. Anti-homeless uh, that sculpture. Was the bell of the ball. No, oh, man. wait. Was a Vito. I think it made me retarded. More retarded. Or, In fact, the like, polls will say I've been right since points. that. I didn't need 10 points. I needed one-tenth of a point. Could be. Uh, if you take a look at the Twitter files. Didn't you, the didn't, you, Twitter <laughs> didn't you, like, confront Vito, Sky? Just those things. I feel like I remember that being a part of the No, no, no. No. No, it wasn't. It wasn't anything. Um, it wasn't anything him. negative. No, uh, he was just the other half of that story. Mm. If I remember correctly. Yeah. No, we were and both then, at and, that protest. It was. Yeah, crazy. and then and then by fate, we met in the show, and then we became best friends. Of votes, votes. So oh, we're still best friends. Files, yeah, we're still best friends. Or when they have fifty-one intelligence agents come out. And lie that Evil Foss is going to win by default because of Russian disinformation. And now they find out it's not, but they knew this that it's not. This is Tom. Bones carry. Did he cancel? Bones definitely, bones definitely carry. Because votes in order to win, are you acknowledging you didn't win? Uh, Tom's going I'm not no, acknowledging. Oh, he's right no, there. I say I won the election. Okay. Even though, again, your lawyers told you oh, you did not. No, no. Did you? Did Some people told me that, okay. but many people told me the opposite. See? How you doing, Q? You okay? Oh my god, it's Turkey Tom! Oh, it's so much. It's Turkey oh Tom. no, Turkey Tom's in this one? Holy shit, he's making a video oh, on all of us. Out. Oh it's my Turkey god. Tom. He's in the Matrix. Holy shit, he's Turkey actually in the Matrix. I'm currently hacking. I'm hacking, yeah. dude. Oh my god, is that the background for the... What, we, what was that meme you talked about? Skadoodle toilet all the time? <laughs> It's Give it a toilet, man. Toilet. You fucking freak. Oof. God, you're such a boomer. It's not Skadoodle. You did send me a good meme, though. I, I know, I did. Yeah. yeah. My the chat audit. I asked for the best Zoomer meme they could, you know, cook up. And are that was you one edging? Did, so. Or are you rizzing? Edging? Oh, I saw um, that one. Edging or gooning? That's a good one. Oh, edging or gooning. You edging That's or fire. gooning? Wow. I'm definitely edging right now. Mm. Oh, cool. Well, well you, said. How do you guys feel? Edging or gooning? What's your vote? What's the no, difference? Gooning. What do you mean, what's the difference? There's a big difference, technically. Yeah, They're what, like what do you opposite mean? things. That's, you fuck. that's like asking the difference between a pussy and an asshole. What do you mean, what's the difference? I think gooning or not. Uh, thank opposite. you, exactly. They're very I'm different. One of, them, one of them has poop in it. One of them has poop in it. Wait, what are you talking about? What you Wait, talking? what? Okay. Which one has poop? Yeah, what? What kind of assholes are you guys fucking? Oh, I thought we were still on gooning. My fault. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, we're, I thought you were. We're, we're still on gooning and edging, Turkey Tom. Okay, bro. God. You guys are freaks. Oh, my God. Yeah. 
Oh, here comes a terrorist. With his signature okay. mask and glasses. Oh my god. Can I, not, can, can I not admire my looks before we start the show? Also, I need to take this mask off soon. My skin is fucked. Anyways. Oh shit. Yeah, we, we, uh, I'm streaming once a week because of it, you know what I mean? Somebody like, supply uh, drop this nigga some aloe vera. Bones! Was Karantos the last Guys, person to Guys, can we keep the N-words to a minimum? I was here the whole time. I was here the whole time. <laughs> no, look, we that <laughs> rule is only in place for power. you, Vito. You I know, but that's yourself. unfair. It's unfair if some people get to use the N-word. Well, I, you, oh, yeah, I, won't, I won't use it yeah, if people are streaming. I won't use it if people are streaming. I think you can say it, Vito. Just say it right now, dude. No, Vito, What's the worst Vito, that could happen? Come on, why would Vito, you challenge we, Vito? He's like the one white guy on the show that will say it with impunity over and over again, okay? Please. That is true. Know. Listen, we don't have Lav here today. The other record holder for N word set on this show. So second place is Vito. Okay, so slow down. All right. Wait, I'm second place. I, I, think, wow. I, I, I think that every white person should just say it. Just let's just get it. <laughs> well, we do. Let's go down. I agree. Vito, <laughs> I mean, you we do first. say it. Like we don't say it in front of you guys. <laughs> yeah. We'll, we'll, we'll do Vito, then Destiny, then Destiny again, and then Vito. How about that? Yeah, let's start with this. Let's, let's not do that shit. Okay. Anyways, let's lock in. Let's start the show. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to episode 26 of Kick or Keep. Today, we brought together eight wonderful contestants that will not be going head to head because they will be in teams of two. What? Oh, that's what this shit is. Oh my god. Yes. New yes. 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 game mode. Fucking drop New that shit. You know what I mean? New game mode, as you can see on the left. I changed your fucking name, so we got Team One. This is how this is how we're going to introduce you. Okay, so I'm doing the introduction while I'm doing the intro. We got Team One, which is Evil Fossil and Turkey Tom. Now it was meant to be evil and vegan, but you know, I mean vegan just. You know, you know what I'm saying? Team Two is Sky and Technicals. Team Three is Vito and Irrelevant. Wait, and last yeah. but not least, Team Four. <laughs> No, wait, hold on. It's what? Vito and... Yeah, yeah. Hold on, hold on, hold on. I was going to say, what the fuck they got? What a name oh, change. Okay, relax. It's, it's Vito and Dick. I, I thought he was it's shitting Vito on Dick. Dick for a second. Me too. Yeah. It's Vito and Dick. It's Vito and Dick. Wait, why would he be Last shitting month. on Dick to call him irrelevant? What? What does that mean, guys? <laughs> no, because I thought he was calling him irrelevant because I thought he was going to say dick. No, it's irrelevant. It's irrelevant. No, no, it's a... yeah, no thought, that's I, not I, what I meant. That's not what I meant. I, I thought that he just changed his name to irrelevant. I was like, holy fuck. Yeah. Don't talk to me or my son ever again. Okay. Damn. Leave my Last team. Last team, irrelevant and Darius. Okay. Now, understand this. We're going to do three rounds of 40 minutes. Jesus. Okay? We're not doing but What? Yeah. Can, can, I'll tell you what. I'll, I'll tell you. I'll tell you why we're doing that because at the end of each round, we're eliminating an entire team. You know Damn. what I mean? So we're doing double the eliminations. You know what I'm saying? Oh, wow. That's like, like the fucking Infinity War. War. You know what I mean? Damn. So guess what? So guess what? If your teammate is a bump, you're gonna lose. So you you, you can't do the solo carry shit. You gotta get your teammate involved, okay? Or else you're gonna lose. And at the end of this show, because this is a special episode, me and Lil Steve, we had a discussion about this. The winner gets ten thousand dollars. What? What he really means <laughs> is, uh, you know what? Because I'm feeling Hold generous, up. because I'm feeling generous, I will say $500 to each person on the winning team, okay? So we'll double oh! the price. Oh, okay, yeah, 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 there you there go. There we go. There you go. I just got you plus 500, by the way. Oh, wow. Congratulations. Excellent bullshitting. Okay. Okay. Oh, God. I actually <sighs> believed it. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> no, there's not ten grand. No, 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 my, no, no, my, my broke ass was like ten grand. Like, <laughs> 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 let me, let me okay. Great. Okay. With all that being said, okay, the rules are very simple. Just don't talk over each other. That's it. Uh, I know n words. This, these fucking videos do not get monetized mm. on YouTube. I need to make some fucking money on YouTube. Hard R or, or A, soft A. It, but, but can A, no, because some things Vito says is outrageous. And the only he way- says the ER. Fun, He says the ER, he says the ER. Vito says the ER. That, that's no, I don't. I, no, I don't, no, I don't. Fake really, news, fake yes, news. You really to he, restrict you my that. Bro. You, people dubbed that clip after the fact. I did not. That was an AI. That was an AI dub. AI, AI Vito. The catch is that it was dubbed, but it was actually just Vito doing a voiceover of the end I said I think I can say it with a little more energy so I, I added to listen it. you could get away with one like 
you know, nigga, but don't say the ER like last time. That was fucking crazy. Okay. Just don't do that. And we'd be good. Okay. In All what right. context did he say it? What was the context of that? I just dropped the ER. He asked me if there were any. I'm not going to do it. What? <laughs> do it. In the no, call. Yeah, any no, group of people. That yeah, was my chance love. to say it again. He, I he asked, what is his least favorite ethnic group? And then he yeah. used no, the word. Yeah. No, no, no. That was it. Actually true. Matter of fact, I he love you, N words. Yeah. yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, stop, Jesus. stop, stop, stop. <laughs> What? I love! Stop, okay, stop. With all that nice. being said, I'm your host, Carantos. Joining me is my co-host, Lil Steve, you wanna say hi? Hello! There we go. Good job. <laughs> Question number one! We already did the intros, I already said your names. We don't have to do the intros right now, okay? Just in case somebody wants to interrupt me and laugh, okay? Question number one. Hmm. Which one should I start with? I like this one. Should minors be criminally liable for lying about their age before a sexual encounter with an adult? Nigga, what the fuck? <laughs> 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 what the fuck? Like, could we just take a second and just hold on, nigga? Damn, it's supposed to be a nice, easy question. Like, no, I want to start. Okay, I'll, I'll start. I'll start. I'm I'm sorry, Sky. Okay. We'll Tom, this Tom is a minor, so let let Tom comment. I'm Tom, 14 years old. You're 14. And I'm willing to answer the question. Okay. You're right. what? Um, <laughs> I'm, I'm 14, bro. You you know this. After that one time, <laughs> you remember? <laughs> that one time. It was what? only once. You should have asked for ID, no, Sky. No, I no, told no, you. stop! Don't say that one asked. time and be vague. That's with yeah, that question. What does he mean by that? I'm just saying. No, no. I'm just saying there wasn't a pattern of behavior. I'm 14 though. I'm actually. Oh, I just turned 14. Anyway, okay. Um. So the real, my real answer to this question, uh, and then I'll let my teammate Evil Fossil come in, is uh much in the way that we we punish uh, minors for when they commit a crime, but not to the same severity as we would punish an adult. I think there should be some kind of penalty. I don't know that it should be years in jail that would like ruin their life forever, but I think there should be some kind of re-education process maybe to uh inform them about how to uh, proceed going forward, not to lie in ways that can damage adults' reputations. I think that'd be an important thing. I don't think it should be like a lengthy jail time. I don't know exactly okay. what the exact sentence should be, but I don't think it can be it can be repercussionless because then kids will just keep doing it forever, you know? Well you want it to be a crime? No, no, hold on, hold yeah. on. Time out, time out. That What's that's the crime. Me, that to me the crime is lying about your age to an adult wrong. and then you sex them and then they get penalized. So you no, get no, statutory but... raped and then you get forced to lie about your age by the adult that wants to send you to prison, right? Is that, that's how not what I said. Really <laughs> is that how this works out in the real world? Is that how it works out in the real world? Y'all coming at my partner, Matt Hall. Let me chime in for my partner because maybe Team Two gonna be going. And I if you if you if you I lie about your if you lie about your age to an adult, is it statutory rape? Well, I assume there's going to be a to lie about your age. Uh, I think it's so. I'm. Wilson got hit for this for statutory rape. I am. I am so completely confused as to why like. How was how was the adult not like checking? That's crazy to me. Like it's weird. No, 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 no. The, point no the point is the adult. The point. The point. The point is the adult checked and then, but the kid had lied. I think we're in this situation. We're yeah. assuming there's like a fake ID. And yeah, like, like a fake ID. Yeah. Like, yeah. Oh, so <laughs> so everything is in place to trick the adult is what you're saying? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Oh, well, okay, here's how okay. I would handle it. Look, I'd say if a guy's being prosecuted for statutory rape and he has evidence that says, look, they showed me a fake ID. Uh, I look at them and they got a big old beard or whatever the fuck else. I think then the judge can lessen the sentence and say, okay, well, you were misled. Uh, you know, it's not great. And you still probably should have done your due diligence. But, the but question I, is you what know, happens you're wilding. You're wilding. I, I know the question is what happens to the child. Wilding. How am I wild? You know, like, like you're, that's you're, kind you're, of you're if a girl like, has a fake ID, you're not going to tell the guy, like, well, it's kind of on her. Bro, the a idea bit. of even having a fake ID is an adult problem. That's society's problem. Children are born into this, into our society that we build, and we give them the tools to be able to fake anything in the first place. What about the and adults that are born into society that wanting to statutorily rape, though? The, you you just open it up for them too. Yes. You're opening it up for them too. Get the fuck out of here. As if yes. them people were not capable of curating or planning the church <laughs> who allowed the. Listen, Wait, just to be I clear. wanted to bring up a perfect example of this, and Team Two, Mo, both of y'all might actually be um acquainted with who I'm gonna bring up. I'm gonna bring oh. up a Captain Zach. Does that does that bring yes. any bells? For, yes. Does that ring any bells for you, technical? I'm, su I'm Scott? surprised you know Captain Zach. Yeah. Um, yeah, yes, I'm rings, just, it, Captain Zach it, is a it, perfect it, example for this it question. It rings bells. Let me just look left for a bit. 
Is this right. more this YouTube well, pedophilia <laughs> deep lore? Because I swear every show talks I don't know about who's a pedophile. Well, well this is no, 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 no. Bro's community degeneracy. That's this what it is. is. This okay, is a case. Right. This is a case in Smash where a 15 year old went after adults and was also punished, but the adults were still punished in this situation. Yeah, was but punished because, like banned from Smash Brothers banned. tournaments. Yeah, yeah, yeah there's, there's no, 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 like I think the judge should ban children who participate in this behavior. Should be banned from all Smash Brothers tournaments. I think that's nah, cool. he's not yeah. playing anything yet. I agree. I agree. Yeah. The whole point is children are not like why are you giving so they much can play Halo. what children are able to do? Like if if a child is actually just replicating what they see adults do, and then that re that results in a situation where an adult is being persecuted, how are you gonna try to hold that child accountable? And when they're okay, just replicating I, Okay, well the right. question the question the question I have for since around my team, we appear to be slightly disagreeing maybe a little bit. What do you think should happen ideally? Just nothing? It's, it's not about that nothing. They should have happen. to smoke the whole pack. It's a fucked up situation in the first place, <laughs> but it's like we, we persecute and we they should have to fuck ten walls. adults. Yeah, if you get caught, if you catch a kid smoking, they gotta smoke child. the whole pack. Yeah, it has a <laughs> penalty to a child. You're not really doing anything to that child. That child is not gonna come out and be like, "Oh man, I just fuck. been through like, so much fucking whole... hell as a child, so I'm gonna be become reformed." Like the point Wait, of. We visit the justice system. Is the, evil, 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 evil. Hold on one second. Sky, you want to Sky, revisit it? No, I, I, I think smoking the whole pack. I like that. You, you were. Oh, all yeah. What? Yeah, yeah, my, yeah. My teammate That's is throwing. Thread. My teammate is absolutely no, hold on, 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 I actually, I, I actually have a response, but technicals, I'm sorry if this fucks us up, because I love you, bro. But look. Go ahead. Okay, so the only reason why this is not, like, there's no there's cognitive dissonance with me is getting lied to by a minor seems the same as clicking on that phishing email link like it feels like it's so obvious when it if it ever does happen to you like if you fall for it there's got to be like some part of you that like was down for that shit and i don't i just i don't like wouldn't that, that be deliberated in the courts like whether or not like if they gave them like the most fucking Chuck E. Cheese ID you've ever seen in your entire life that fucking has a slanted picture and it's like, see, I'm 18. Like, yeah, exactly. yeah obviously <laughs> then they're going to be like, all right, you fucked a kid and you knew you were fucking a kid. Sky, but are you some... trying to argue that teenagers are horny? Is that your argument? <clears throat> Nigga, what are you? See, this I is why I, I have to question. use nigga. I reject this that question. Why. I reject that question. I reject. No, this All is right. why I have to say nigga because he said you don't have to shit. reject that question. That's a reasonable question. But you're saying like you know she's out there trying to get fucked, right? How sexy would they have to be for like how much ID you require? Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> yeah, really oh, oh, right, right. Like that's good enough for me. Okay, all right, okay, and the judge okay, goes. Okay, yeah, I mean, you know, this is this is about yeah. whether the child gets, <laughs> without, gets punished in this situation. Okay, okay. That's without, the without, question. without the cuties conversation, Tech, I'll ask you the question. Don't you right. think there should be some kind of um. I don't know education program for that kid to learn I, like not. But to you're, talking about, you're, you're talking about a legal no, that, punishment. There's, pump, pump. Well, there's a juvie for less. Punishment. There's juvie for less. Court mandating you can't have sex with adults I, class. Okay, okay. And whoever teaches that class is a pedophile. So. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. okay. Yeah, yeah that's sus. I don't know exactly what it would look like. I don't think they should go to jail. I'm just saying the there should be some do, process to yes. tell them not to do that. I will teach the class, and I'll be a great teacher. Thank you. Because if they just get off with it, and it's just like, oh, okay, we're we're gonna punch the adult less. Then, like, what's gonna stop them from going and doing this shit again? What do you they mean by get off least... with it? Like, um, I mean, hopefully, time. The, hopefully the, they if, they're, if, 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 if they lie and there's no repercussions, I'm sorry, stop never mind. Fucking, Jesus stop fucking Christ, fuck shit, me, bro. Oh, that's I got it. Motherfucker. Can y'all give me an example of something that stopped kids from doing shit over again? I'm like, honestly, where the when the last time they their ass whipped? Getting their ass whipped. Beating yeah. their fucking ass. I remember coming home yeah, at 3 a.m. Yeah, one time, yeah. Bring and, out I, the and, 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 yeah. and the hanger yeah. came out. My mom yeah. looked my yeah. fucking yes. big black ass, and I never was out yes. late again. But I'm yeah, but the black community is so good at stopping underage sex. Why do you guys get sex We What are you talking about? Our kids. I feel like your community is doing the worst. No, no, no. Our black kids. Our black kids are not going out there. You white bitch. We are talking about. They got like twelve kids. Oh no! Oh no! 
on the internet, bro. Did you want a D's nigga? You are lying on our stuff. Okay, stop. Wait one second. I'm the only make four kids instead of eight. Whatever, Jesus. Hey, you are you are picking the wrong. I'm not just saying the black community's parents' ideas. We aren't we aren't known for many kids. We're known for not having dad. Shut up. You don't even know your place. What are you talking? You got an imbalance of kids for dads. Not as many as Hispanics, but you guys are putting numbers. Okay, stop, stop, stop. One at a fucking time. God damn. And somebody sounds like he's deep throwing his mic. I don't know who it is, but fix your mic, whoever that is. Test one, one, two. Test, 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 test. It might be me. Test, test, test. Yeah, Arolovin, I think it's you. Don't cough into your mic again, please. All right, go ahead, Sky. You're going to say something. VW was waiting for that fucking opportunity, huh? What opportunity? Yeah. He said opportunity black people hit their kids and the kids end and up shit. not having sex. Yeah, and I'm like, that's what, I, I no, reject that that's hypothesis. No, I, I, no, 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 no. I was saying. Kids. When the I, last time you seen? When the last time you seen a white family with fucking six, seven kids without them fucking mentally cracking, blowing the fuck up and shooting up a goddamn school? When the last time you seen that what shit? What are you talking about? Black people shoot a sperm white guy shit up It ain't black kids, bro. They in fucking communities, bro. They Our, with their people. I think most school shooters are like, like only only children. Where did when like did how we get, a conversation about yeah, ID and children cool. turned into a race war? Yeah, I, yeah, yeah, I blame you. Stick, you know. stick to the topic. Stick to the topic, guys. Stick to the topic. Let's not make this about race. Wait, does anybody actually disagree with Turkey Tom's take? Like actually, genuinely, no, actually, oh, there he is. No, actually, okay, because I, I feel yeah, like it's not really to a hold thing. some kind of legal punishment for somebody who is proven to have tried to lie and deceive somebody about their age uh, when it comes to having a sex with having sex with a minor. I feel like well, some kind really, of punishment. Can I ask you a what punishment that is? I that's think up for debate, but probably some kind of punishment. Because you you would punish a minor if they like lied and then bought alcohol, right? You wouldn't just be like, oh, right. whatever, they're a kid. Like you'd punish them, right? Here, here's the thing, guys. There there are legal repercussions, but you know you can have consequences for kids without dragging the law into it. I don't need to drag. What would your consequences be? Well, that's say, not smoking the, the whole law, pack. We're not saying there should be necessarily some kind yeah, of. Yeah, I like, know you want to teach the kids sex or punishment. Though, a lot it. of it, a lot of it should be like it should just be education for like the school department or something. I don't know. The, the or just tell the parents, hey, your horned up fifteen year old is trying to fuck a bunch of adults. Uh, lock it down. Uh, you know, like this can be handled at home. Uh, yeah, but it is it down? is it the state? They couldn't keep their kid. They couldn't keep their sure kid from lying to, to an adult. Sex. They couldn't keep their kid from lying to an adult. They don't even know what's going on on their fucking phone. How are we supposed to trust them to reeducate that kid? They're probably gonna be like, oh, there's has... another guy down the street. No, the the government has that, enough problems the problem. that I don't need them trying to lock down horny 15 year olds. Okay, you don't even have kids. You're probably infertile, you fat fuck. You're on Ozempic. I probably am infertile. <laughs> you can't All even right, have kids. Go. You're basically a fucking woman. Your estrogen's so fucking if I was high. Black, yeah. I'd have and yet you have enough kids. tests well, to have no hair in your head. And despite that. No, Stop keep going. Keep, 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 keep going. Keep going. The go. thing about the about the legal repercussions, right? Because all right, when someone you know there's manslaughter and then there's like premeditated murder, right? There's intent described behind a crime. The whole point is whether or not a child can actually be prescribed intent. And then, and do you really honestly think that again, if children, as they do what they see and they do what they're around, fully understand or have the intent to lie, just because a fucking adult was stupid enough to to get caught in it or get away with it like how can you sit there and say because of the because of what you've seen and the problem that happened that the the child actually had the intent to, well, nobody um, would to argue that they had people. we would treat them as if they had full intention or motive to be able to do it that's why they're being tried as a child and they're giving a lesser punishment if we saw like somebody was intentionally trying to lie about like a rape situation or, and they were an adult they would be treated much more harshly harshly than somebody lying about their age who was a kid wouldn't it like, wouldn't it be different if the person like it, like depending on how far they went with the lie is how we would treat them like if they were just texting sure. and they were like oh i'm 18 then okay you lied you get tried as a kid but if you have a full-on like fake passport fake id that looks good and like you're doing all these other things and you get like arrested for that shit. Well, I think, well, I, I think that's also a separate crime could, that's like technically yeah. fraud i think it, yeah. it's like so the, you're getting into like yeah, some federal right. shit at that point mm-hmm 
Yeah. I think the, the point is, is the difference between a dumb a dumb kid and a smart kid, and I like, do I, be tried the same. I do like what, what you're saying, like, Eagle Fossil, because it puts the it puts the onus on the adult, which is like what what should be the case, and they should yes. be verifying all that information. Well, the it's consequences just, for the adult also matter, right? Like, did they yes. did they just flirt? Did they sex? Did they exchange images? Did they have sex in real life? Like all these things can because there's other the layers. Nah, put them away. Put them away. The fuck they doing? Even talk. Nah, put them away. I think the what point about like thirty year olds lying and saying they're like fourteen year old girls? That's an even bigger problem, right? <laughs> to to what? To sex to other? Let kids? them off. Yeah. They're fine. They'll hang out with Vito. Okay. They'll go to high hey, school with him. Like Chris Can Hansen. We, this, that guy really this, messed this, things this up. Vito, this Vito slander. This Vito slander. We gotta just. All right, that's my Man, boy. Dick is funny. I want to you know, say uh, you he's your boy. Five minutes ago you were complaining you must stop making pet. No, jokes. he loves me. He loves me. Uh oh, here's the problem. <laughs> Kids are getting a lot of uh, this is why I can't hold any kid accountable for this kind of behavior. Is like we, the way we teach kids about sex is totally fucked up. Because we are like, oh, just don't tell them anything about sex and they'll figure it out on their own. And then they go on Pornhub and they learn how to choke the shit out of each other. Like kids are getting crazy mixed messages about sex. They're getting horned out of their minds. I see some of the kids on like fucking Tumblr, and I'm like, "What are you doing? Yeah. Uh, posting some of this fucking Tumblr. shit?" So yeah. Tumblr, okay. Yeah, just like all or Twitter Tumblr. or whatever yeah. else. Uh, like the second they bro. turn eight, like the second they nigga. turn eighteen, they're trying to fuck everybody, and the, obviously some of them are starting before then. I don't think so think that's true. No, he, Honestly, he, I don't no, think no, that's no. true. I think you're projecting, bro. No, you don't no, think these not, kids are trying to get fucked? Kids are like people being fucking virgins and people like being like 26, 30 without even ever being in a fucking relationship. It don't matter if they sitting there and they fucking brain. Talking about they want to fuck everything ever. Dude, they're Honestly, like the men the yeah. at like twelve people. The most inept people to get sexual shit are the horniest, craziest shit on the internet. That they, they be the ones posting the crazy shit on the internet. The ones who actually be the out there people? fucking don't be saying shit. Like they the ones who socially aware, just like say, yo, you want to come down tonight? You want to do this? You want to do that? You want to go to the bar? You want to go out there? Um, okay, can the I recenter? Let me recenter real quick. Okay, technicals. Got this back on track twice with very good questions. Okay, so resounding a little bit. Okay, it, this idea that like the child doesn't know what they're doing or whatever. When nobody's talking about a child just lying and saying like, "Hey, I'm 20 years old." They're talking about a child going out of the way to get a fake ID to lie to somebody else to have sex. So I think Technicals was the one that brought up when children do this with fake IDs for alcohol purchases. Don't they get in trouble for that? Why would it be different here? Go ahead. No, nah, get that shit out of here because we giving them weight. Imagine, imagine the world where what Turkey Tom 14 ass fucking got a Snapchat filter right now, aging him up to fucking 30. What's yeah. the what are we gonna do in the world where that's possible? Where these kids are sitting there with age filters and now you on video well, and is, the motherfucker look okay, like they're 30. But, and but that's like not the available. We pose a problem. We pose it's a specific our, hypothetical. And like you can say it's just giving them the technology. I mean, but technology is Look, we're, existing we're not, for, for we're, everybody. It's ever present. There's a parallel. But if a kid misuses so technology, they didn't know they didn't know how not to use it. There's yes, I, want to make it I am agreeing with you. Yes. Oh, well, I want to make we're, a really quick we're... distinction about what Destiny said. So Destiny, uh, whether or not a kid misrepresents their age, let's say a kid goes into a liquor store and says, Hey, I'm 14, sell me beer, and then buys the beer, that's still illegal, even though they didn't misrepresent their age, right? Whereas if a 14 year old goes to, you know, a 20 year old and says, hey, I'm 14, let's have sex. It's not illegal for them to do that. Uh, it, Wait, you know, I don't know if it's illegal it, to lie. Wait, is it illegal to illegal. lie about your age? Um, no, no. So the first the one was ID part is the illegal. Yeah, we're talking. They're talking about using a fake ID to induce someone else to a crime, essentially. Yeah, we are, we already. But have I'm saying that no matter using. what, a minor obtaining liquor is illegal. Yes, but it and, is but not also, illegal for a minor to have sex with an adult. Yeah, but that's what we're posing the question yeah. for. Is, like, like, we're not saying we're not saying that. Hold on, lighting. the minor. To be clear, wait, wait, wait. To be clear, the question. Just refocusing the question. The question is not should it be illegal for a minor to have sex with an adult. The question is, should it be illegal for them to produce a false ID to induce the right. older person to fuck them? Not, it wouldn't make because it illegal. The, is that the adult would never have had sex with a minor if they knew they were a minor, but because they thought they were an adult because of the fake ID, then they decided to do it, and then they're charged with a crime. You understand? Vito? I'm saying you can't the compare shit it to the liquor. The fake you ID can't... shit is dumb because you're missing a point that the only reason why you even have the fake ID, it's because they're circumventing the... It's the fucking store that sold the 
liquor to the child that is coming under the most persecution. It's not a fucking child getting a fake ID going in the store. So we go after the child. Be like, so if I'm a cop and I go in the store and I'll be like, yo, this child bought the fucking I bought this fucking liquor with the ID and it's fake. I'm not gonna be sitting there like now. I gotta fucking go do my research and read and find where. But the, the problem is, the problem is, some fake jail. IDs will actually you know scan a store, so they're they're ba they look and, yeah. and feel. There's basically there's weird. steps to this that are more illegal than just purchasing the alcohol. I feel like if anything, you should be litigating the fact that these fake IDs are being like created in the first place. Yeah, we'll go after Does whoever's making the fake IDs. Kids have fake yeah, IDs. That's what I'm saying. How many kids have fake IDs? I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't think there's an epidemic of fake IDs <laughs> and fucking adults, guys. I think right. that this hypothetical Man, is a very right. I think it's more fuck about you, just bro. misrepresenting like, your age. You go yeah, to a party, it's, you it's, tell it's, a guy you're 18. It's misrepresenting your age by any stretch. It's not just only oh, we can't punish so that. Fuck that. Like, all you motherfuckers mad internet and y'all mad scared of kids lying to y'all and getting. I feel like I feel like you should punish, punish the fake IDs. That's all I'm that's, hearing that's right my now. Favorite, the, 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 the fake IDs, but the kids, it's fucking kids, bro. I I, I don't understand yes, this shit. Yeah, it is. It is fucking kids. It is fucking kids. Literally, it was mad internet fucking debauchery when y'all was young, and there was no way y'all fucking parents would stop. I'm gonna be 100 with you, also. Bro, bro, uh, just stop talking, nigga. Damn, uh, stop talking. You're done. If I saw you, just... you, bro, it's honest to God because you don't get bitches, bro. And I've on Tinder all the fucking time, dude. I've seen multiple girls, unfortunately, that have got their Snapchats, been talking to them, and then they sent me a picture in a fucking high school bathroom, and then I find out, oh, okay, they are a what? minor. I would have had sex with them that night. That I'm looking at you. I'm looking at let him finish. 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 Let him you do get oh. 19 year olds on Tinder, nigga. Shut the fuck up, nigga. Go outside and actually talk to a woman, nigga. Fuck out of here, nigga. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 12-year-old woman. I'm so <laughs> sad that I'm not talking about that. How much child porn do you have to do that? I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Self-report, nigga. Self-report. If I use your sports, nigga. You can't just talk. Stop talking. You're all these girls. I'm peeking. You're peeking. I can't hear. Stop, if everybody, I use, stop if I stop use your logic time. and I if I use your logic and I went out in person, IRL, the problem would still stand where people are using fake IDs. I've on I've, okay, I'm in Texas. I moved to Texas, Austin, Texas, where that fucking starship mothership uh comedy show thing is. There's a bar right across it. I went there and I used a picture, a fucking picture to get into the bar. And I when I looked yeah, around, I swear to god, I swear to god, dude, there's a ton of 16-year-olds in these Austin, Texas bars. Bad, Don't know why the fuck it is. I I I didn't obviously I didn't hit on them, but like I was horny that day and I wanted to talk to the girls around me but unfortunately i didn't fucking know what the oh, age was of anybody around me so i kept my peace like 80 of the this... people in that bar were so the real 16. problem is you didn't hey, get they were, the they were 100 percent underage yeah, the, pro the pro like, big problem the is that i don't get the fuck because of underage people you could go. no the problem is you aiming as young as you could go and you spook I ain't no yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I would just delete the app. 16 dude, I'm I'm getting caught. i ain't never getting caught bro Two to three years. Wait, 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 w
That means he's never getting called lacking. No, no, you ain't yeah. a real nigga like me. Okay, he's, he's saying he's not getting called lacking. I get what you're trying to say, false. Okay, okay. okay. But like, would you ever say like I'm never gonna get caught sucking dick? Would that be a? Would that be something? Yeah, think that about yeah. Yeah. And that would be a terrible <laughs> thing. <laughs> right. Right. <laughs> Can, do we all agree that you should at least litigate like fake IDs? Yes. yes. Uh, yes. But, but, but like, how are you going to do, do it? Okay. Yeah. I'm that? against IDs. Why what should do you, what we, do you why should we trust this system of having IDs? Why does the government need to track you? It puts like this idea that it puts this idea of um, that you're guaranteed to be this age out on the people. I don't like it at all. I don't think we should rely on it. What? Well, we need some well, way to turn um, it. I think I think I think it's I think it's fine yeah. for stores and shit to do it. I don't think you should have people relying on it. That's fucking retarded. Like if I don't, I'm never gonna like ha I'm not gonna buy an ID verification thing. So whenever I invite a girl over from Tinder, I can just like swipe their card at my door to make sure they're fucking eighteen plus. It's fucking. That's a good point though. The dick makes an ID is a contract with the government. It's not a contract with other people. If someone shows you their ID. Uh, you should very much be like, well, that's a piece of evidence I can use to try to deduce your age, but uh, I'm not selling you liquor and I'm not selling <laughs> you uh, car insurance. So I mean, maybe the, I'll what, do a little better, more. Okay, well, well, the question, a better you know, way of determining you know, the somebody. question becomes the question becomes, can you have sex with anyone ever then? Because if you can never trust yeah. their ID, yeah, you, you just can't don't, trust, you just never like, fuck. What do you use? Uh, uh, no, you shouldn't be I mean, that's bro, no. big tits, I bro. I mean, no. She couldn't be 16. It's like that the I'm saying don't use their ID. There were some as a good argument, man. You know, what do we what do we do then? What what is the Wait, why do you Yeah, what's the alternative? Yeah, what are we talking about? Hang out on Snapchat. Don't go to bars with 15 year olds. I mean, I don't know, man. Every relationship. No, no, no. Then they get an easier. Then they get an easier. If there's no ID, I'm asking. What is. What? If there's no ID, 15 year olds are going to be in like all the bars. Ask them what if they like stickers. And if the answer is yes, don't have sex. Okay, that's Dude, what? 16. Okay. Do you want to talk about stickers? I don't know what their grades are in math class. There are a lot of adult moms that like stickers and Hello Kitty, and it's kind of fucked up. Are you guys IDing all the women you fuck? I just fuck adults, so I've never had this problem. You don't fuck. You fuck. I fuck. I don't believe that. I just don't like, I've never been in a situation. Again, I'm a 35 year old man. I'm I'm having sex with other 35 year old women. Like, men. there's no chance <laughs> of them to and men. That's and it. there's no Just chance. Men. Can you of say them. I'm gay? Can you say I'm fat and gay? Sorry. Yeah. Oh, I'm gay and I am fat. Okay. Can you say it the other way? I feel I'm fat and gay. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Here's yeah, the yeah, sound yeah, bite. Yeah. There it is. Is that, yeah. is right, that really? Is work, that really Tom. the sound? That sound Good work, Turkey Tom. Tom. As a fat gay sure man. Everybody. I'm having sex with other fat gay men, and at no point have I looked at any of them and been like, hey, that's uh, it probably might be underage. Like, you're an adult. I can understand if you're in your 20s, like maybe you're going to be hitting the line. We and all are. A little more worried. Yeah, yeah, most yeah, of us aren't 35 20s. and fat and gay. Yeah, like most True. people are going to be dating and having sex probably in their uh, mid, early, and late 20s. They're definitely going to run into people who are probably in their early 20s, maybe potentially late teens. How are they supposed to verify their age? Like, well, Vita, like, I, I understand you're just saying, like, use judgment, which I don't think yeah. is entirely... Rely like, more worst... on judgment, then. Yeah, it's not, I, I it's not a part of it. It's a part I'm not in my 20s. Are all the 20-year-olds carding each other now? Is that no, a thing? No, fuck no. Nobody's doing this shit. Turkey no, time, no, no, one, a girl. no one's carding anyone. Vita, nobody's carding. Actually, well, then what is the point actually, of the idea if no one's looking you know, at you it? You know what, Vito? I actually have I actually have carded a girl, yeah. You carded a girl. Okay. That does happen on occasion. Your reputation, Yeah, Yeah, it also is a normal... He's a YouTuber, so he attracts yeah, a bunch of like, people. Everybody, everybody's talking yeah, about it like it's the most common thing in the world. Well, and obviously, Vito, we're fucking gay niche micro celebrity influencers, so obviously we're asking the question. Yeah, but that's that okay. Sure. Yeah, you should be carding people if you have, you know, I don't know if you're somebody who could be targeted. You just don't for... know. You're right. Say I don't know, because well, you just don't know. I'm, I'm just, at you fucking just don't know, twenty year olds. So yeah, I don't know. I'm not. I'm you fucking people know. in my own age. What do you know? What are you fucking anyone? Know. I have never needed to card a girl. If you guys, but are is this gonna girls, stop it? Is this gonna stop a, an underage uh, girl from getting fucked? Because like, does nah, it stop? Someone... Does it stop liquor sales? No, I drink I underage. I so, does it's it like, stop underage smoking? There has to be like some underage. Don't got nothing to do. There has to be some kind of barrier. It can't just be like, Sorry. oh, it's the Wild There's West because like some gonna... people get through. If the law isn't stopping it. anything. What's the point of the law? Tom, no, have you ever law, made a joke? I, I, but the thing about it is like, if you take like age 15 to like 22 or like 15 to like 25, those people in that group, 
like if you're vetting between there, that's where this whole conundrum comes up, right? Like it doesn't necessarily come up for any other age group, really. If you're not like, again, fucking 40, aiming for like 18 year olds and that's all the fuck you ever look at. If that's not the case, then there's only really a problem for like early 20 year old people. Yep. Right. Like, that's, so that's, that's, that's still like millions of people. Like, I'm, 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 I'm 27 and a, and a girl like three months ago from a, a specific community that I interact with a lot, she would message me, she was like flirt me, she was like, oh, you want to meet up to us, blah, blah, blah. And then I already flirted with her or whatever, and at the end I was like, wait, how old are you? And then she said she was 17. So it, I'm like, I'm not 27, serious. it doesn't matter. You got a lot of answers. I'm not serious. Serious. I guess. Because, because, and you're committed to He's not a bad guy. He's upper range for his Tinder uh, age at like 20. That's the reason why. I'm talking to this girl on Club Penguin, and I thought bro. she was of age, and then she said, uh, it's "Club Penguin, nigga, you do you? It's, it's like Snapchat and Instagram, like on, Tinder." Sounds like you're on Club Penguin. All okay, right. let me. Okay, let me do a slight, a slight refocus. A slight refocus. Okay, so I think that the reason why this particular crime is different than all the others is because. Uh, statutory rape is a strict liability offense, okay? That means that you don't have to prove any, like, criminal state of mind when you're convicting somebody. That means that if you fuck somebody and they happen to be a minor, boom, you're fucked. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter if you knew it, if you didn't know it, whatever, whatever, right? Now, this type of thing doesn't exist for, say, if you serve an alcohol, if you serve alcohol to a minor. So let's say that a minor shows up to a store, they give you a fake ID, and then you sell them alcohol. As long, I think the state's obligation generally, this is my very state, state, in Florida at least, I think if you ask them for the ID, then you're safe, as long as the ID looks real. But that same protection doesn't exist for uh, an older person that fucks a younger person or whatever. So the, the question is, should this type of inducement to commit this strict liability offense, should there be any responsibility on the minor here because the person that you're tricking has absolutely no defense in court if they get caught for this particular so, thing? Like so just specific. to give an example of something like this that I saw that happened, uh, I think it was in Florida. I believe the age of consent there is 16. Um, and there was a case where a 19-year-old guy had met a girl who he thought was 17 uh online they weren't influencers or whatever they were just normal people uh he meets up with her apparently they had sex with the park and only after the fact he found out she was 14. he's now a registered sex offender when he thought he was having sex with a 17 year old who i assume oh. all you guys would say a 19 year old fucking 17 year old who fucking cares right but yeah. because she because she was actually under the age of consent by two years he is now a registered sex offender as a 19 year old and has to inform people in his community that he's a sex offender when he thought he was having sex with someone who was of age and like within reasonable age for him to have sex with like there was no problem it, with that does, in his mind does, it, does anybody know what happened to josh giddy isn't he like the most recent person that had was like i think like 19 and the girl's like i don't 16, think anything 17. happened to that guy and no, I think they she didn't pursue charges. That's point. Point. Recent, yeah, she didn't okay. pursue but charges. It, it, but she couldn't didn't her family want to do something about it though no they didn't because like, she lied she lied about her age that's why she, so didn't. so wait so if she lied about her age then it's just up to the person if they want to pursue charges or not then it's like, because like here's a good question. I, I, like, I, I actually is, is don't it, know how that works. If that's I mean, the case, and I think most people that have lied and confirmed they lied, they want to pursue charges just because that would be like probably well, a nightmare. On the internet, life. when you hear cases like this and you hear that the other person lied about their age, instantly you're like, oh, wow, that's kind of fucked up. But there's no like legal precedent for that person to fight for themselves in court if they do press charges, which is what I think we're kind of no, talking about. Also, hold on. We're, just as a, this is a little bit of a misnomer. I, I could be wrong, but there, I don't think there actually is a thing as press charges. That, that's like not a real thing. If the police catch you doing something illegal and it's a criminal act, they will yeah. prosecute you for it if they have evidence for it. Now, you as an right. individual might call the police and report a crime, so in a way, or the cops might ask you, like, informally, do you want to press charges, meaning are you willing to be a witness to this particular thing? If we go to court and you say no, well, they have no witnesses. You can't really, like, press charges as a civilian. It's a criminal matter, and it's up to the courts and the DA to do that. Wait, you know, it's a shame like, there's no way. Wait, 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 yeah, wait that's, Destiny. That's, that's that cancel culture yeah, brain shit. Destiny, you he's can't, actually, you, can't you can't you right. can't chase after like let's say you're the victim of someone lying about their age. You can't like you can't get them, so to speak. No, like, no, no. I don't think it's that, a crime yeah, for a minor to lie right? to you about their age. That's just not a crime, I don't think. Yeah, it's, it's not a crime. Yeah, criminal thing question would be about whether or not it could be a crime, right? If it's a like, crime like that, you're just going to get prosecuted. It's whether, like, you're actually going to be, like, a witness in the case of what he's saying. Like, you don't have to press charges, quote-unquote. If they can right. prove that you've done that, then you could be prosecuted. Should you be sure, able to sure, civilly sure. sue a yeah. minor in court for ruining your reputation? And uh, yeah, like Base, you should be able to. That would be awesome. That would be sick as fuck. 
Uh, I think yeah, if man, there was women on this panel, you. they would all have done this shit, and none of them would let you send them to jail for it. Or I, take any it, it, no. it, 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 All of them it, have done this it, shit. It, it, speak what, on it. Wouldn't it be defamation? Like, if they're saying, like, you, I, this person raped me? That's a civil what, suit, though. Yeah, yeah. So then, look, yeah. that would That's be, what what be maybe the real maybe the real problem. Yeah. Considering this is all an all male panel, maybe we can all come together to agree the real problem is women. Um, maybe. actually, I don't think Thank that. You. Holy I shit! Would get that. That's insanely misogynistic. Fuck you. Oh my uh, what the fuck? Crazy, bro. How old are you? What? By the way, how old are you? I'm seventeen next week. Yeah. I'm next week literally. Thank you so much for the oh, oh, that freaked me out. I thought, who the fuck joined the Dude, I was so man. confused. Was <laughs> my fault. All right, here's my question. Should a judge be allowed to consider evidence that a minor uh, lied about their age during sentencing? So you got a guy in front of you, he's accused of I think, they, I think some rape. states already do. Okay. I, they but we're might, all okay they might. with that. You said during like, sentencing? Are you okay or... with somebody getting a lesser sentence? He said during sentencing. That they have text messages showing she said she was of age, I was misled. We think yes. that's reasonable. I'm fine yeah, they should yes. register as a sex offender. That's what I, I think should be. Uh, yeah. I, 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 I mean, I if she lied, lied I'm, case case by case by case. I'm interested I in Fossil. Fossil seems to be saying like he's on the edge on that. I think it's a pedophile. Bro. You know, yeah, I think we're really okay, like, As someone like you who <laughs> only date or want to fuck with women at least like three to four years in my range, I just never see that that shit will happen. So it's like if I'm lied to and then all of a sudden, like what the 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 okay, fucking so, child so fossil, shows fossil, up how, in my fossil, how, how old are you? How old are you? Five hundred and fifty-one. Okay, I'm twenty-one. Three or four years of my age is fucking. Four years you're younger really than me, they could be in fucking high school. But it's yes. No, nah, you're you're, you're right. No, nah, that's but that's why I brought up what Relly said before is that it actually is, but it, it seems more nuanced, right? Like how much of a population really are you? Like it seems like something that I we mean, there's a lot. Discuss, there's a decent the amount of twenty-one year olds. Discuss this. Million. Yeah, but the, but it's still it's still. It, it's the vast lot, majority of people who are going to be majority. dating and having sex are going to be in that age range. So it yeah. is. But people are the horniest the when they're young, and and that's when you're going to make the most mistakes. 15, you don't think yeah, fifteen correct. to twenty year olds fuck? Are you kidding? You're gonna you're gonna I you're gonna be very so, very like I'm, quick to judgment. You're gonna be very just like ready. I'm to saying is that the law, like right, right now y'all bringing in like y'all bringing in like the law is objective, bro. Like it's supposed to be objective as possible. No, like, the law was no. for everyone. So, no, it's a reflection of society. It's a reflection no, of society that yeah. changes. But what we're talking about, if you're saying something like, oh, most people like 15 and 20 are going to be fucking, that's a social that's a social thing. Like, that depends yeah, on what true. fucking part of society are you on. Yes, yeah, so yeah, it's it is. That's, that's also a biological thing. thing. Um, you, what does you, it have to do with the question at hand? The, the question at hand is in regards to the consequences, which you seem unable to answer. And I'm embarrassed because you're my teammate. I feel like you should be able to answer clearly your reasoning behind this. Oh, yeah, we've got a team divorce heart. coming up. Karantos, do they have the option oh, to do that? Yeah. Like, he's he's in a relationship. Oh, they're so bro. hard to make. <laughs> <laughs> a team divorce. I like that. All right, can you rephrase the question one more time? Just so okay. I can be 100% clear. Okay, okay. So the question is, why do you not think that there should be a lesser sentence? Or why do you not think there should be some kind of punishment for the minor if they lie about their age? Because the point, the whole point of this hypothetical is that the adult thought they were doing something legal and it turned out they were doing something illegal. And the point is that they were given every reason to think they were not doing something against the law, right? Why do you, why do you not and, see, like... And we're going to 100% understand that the, the sexual action actually went down. Like, sexual action went down. Yeah, I don't um, think it's... So they, they have sex. Let's, let's Bro, give you a hypothetical. Just, let's, how, wait, 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 wait. Shut up, shut up. Oh, shit. Let's give a hypothetical. Let's give a hypothetical. Matters. Wait, no, let me talk. Let's give... Okay, first I'll give you the example. Let's say they don't have sex. Let's say they sexted, yeah. no news were sent. Mm. No. I think no, no the, the the female. I mean, not the female. Holy shit, my bad. I'm being sexist, like you motherfucker. No, um, that's right. Yeah, yeah, I think the child, there should be repercussions. I agreed with you from the beginning that there should be schooling or there should be something something that we have in place that we don't have now, where yeah. they should be taught the repercussions or like the fact that they do have intent and they lied and that they should be okay. Shown so so let's take it. Let's take it one step further. <clears throat> Real quick, let's wait, say, right before Turkey. Say, wait, wait, right before Turkey takes it one step further because he's about to hold that thought, Turkey. We are at the bottom of round one. Make oh, sure shit. you guys yeah. vote to who do you, you which what do you team? Mean? I'm gonna keep not kick. Good luck. What do you mean you need to teach people what's wrong or right? Don't you like literally learn that? Y'all keep conflating. Y'all keep conflating. Like you're, this you is need a double thing. You need to go through. 
there's two things going on here. Y'all y'all also saying that the 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 um okay. young yep. one who lied should have consequences. Not but y'all also saying the, that on the side of that lying. because they have it consequences that the but, person but who offended it. should be let to have lesser sentence because they were lying but to manipulate But it's not even just like lying. Different thing. As uh, an adult, not, I do not think that if you get caught in this situation. It's not even just lying though. They're going through like three different hoops. They're they're lying. Yeah. They're going to a yeah. bar underage. I mean, they're you messaging up let's, let's try a different because you're getting to a you're no, no, getting to a more thing, interesting no. question. Evil yeah, you're this, getting is, to a... this is corny because if you if you had like some <laughs> underprivileged ass fucking dumbass third world fucking country <laughs> child fucking trying to lie like some Ethiopian fucking child nigga that's a scammer and learn how to do a scam <laughs> right. yeah. how about how about this child no this is some bullshit wait hold on Boston hold on Boston no I want to hear about Ethiopia yeah yeah Ethiopians catching strays I want to know understand this y'all keep attributing like this kind of moral standard to a child who has a whole bunch of autonomy that could have been given to them from birthright, motherfucker. Like, Where they, they could just have a whole right. lot of access. They They're could have people who have already given them IDs Let's... and already showing them them things. I... Like, look, listen. Oh, Boston, no, Boston, no, Boston, 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 Boston. Can I give you a Let hypothetical? Let jump in. Can I give you a hypothetical? And this is something that everybody yeah, can ahead. engage in because it sounds like it's kind of getting to this point anyway. Actually, Let's unfortunately, somebody... irrelevant. You, I'm man. so sorry about your hypothetical. Unfortunately, irrelevant. That hypothetical... Because the round was over, that hypothetical is never going to be heard oh by Sky Williams and Technicals because that is the team that has been voted oh off. I am so God. sorry. Oh Sky God. Williams and Technicals, Whoa. you're at the bottom of the vote. I can't believe it. I'm not going to lie. I thought the girl voice would actually That's why I pulled it out. That's why I pulled it out. I, I, I thought that was the carry right there. Yeah. Right, and it, the refocus. It's probably me, honestly. Technicals, you carried. You went. No, yeah, you got the energy. You got I the energy. thought you're never gonna catch me was gonna uh, get him knocked out, but I guess not. <laughs> no, I, 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 I thought like I'll never get caught. I was like, oh, he's gone. There's no way. This like, is. You funny. forgot what community okay. you were uh, appealing to here, so yeah. <laughs> anyway. True. All right, thanks I for having me. Caught. It was fun. All right, you guys. Thank you for coming on, Sky. Bye, bye, have fun. Have a good one. Okay, congratulations. Can I ask my hypothetical though? Yeah. Do I it. know we want to move on. Yeah. Okay. Go so on, go ahead. let's say somebody, because I personally, right, at 17, I had fucking gray hairs. I still have gray hairs, right? So me at 17, right, let's, with my gray ass fucking hairs, six foot tall, let's say I meet somebody, a, a, a woman who's like 25 or something like that, and we have sex. I, sh I produce her a fake ID. I produce her like, a, a fucking passport all this shit like i go through and i have the goddamn like i could be served 50 years in prison how many fake documents i have right fake birth certificate and everything and then she has sex with me should she face any time at all no that's not no, but that's we're gonna no. protect 17 year old boys from okay so we so we disagree no. so we disagree no, with the idea that oh, i forget what the word destiny said earlier it's about strict liability us. Strict liability. That the statutory rape should not be a strict liability. It should be as a result of the reasonable uh, assumptions that somebody can make based off the information they're given when they have sex with another person. So we all agree with that. Yes or no? I think that's yeah. very reasonable. I think that's yes. very reasonable too. Yeah, right. uh, just to be clear. But it sounds like Evil Fossil disagrees because you no, keep because... you kept saying over and over again, "Fuck it, bro." Like, dude, you're seventy, hundred percent on the spot. Do you agree that if I produce a sufficient amount of like fake documentation, like I genuinely look like I could be in my early 20s and I can prove this in a court that I should face any or this hypothetical other woman should face any jail time or legal Let's say I want to fuck a 5,000 year old dragon. Okay, okay, shut up. She looks like a four year old. Fucking weeaboo retard. I want to hear the guy's question, okay? Go ahead, Evil fossil. Schizo connection. Please engage my hypothetical now because I just finished reading about a case where a dude beat up a trans woman, trans dude, um, because in his words in court, he said, I felt violated because I had my dick sucked by a dude, right? Mm. And then what <laughs> happened was he got off. Why? Because they looked at the history of the dude that he killed. Um, the, the dude, I mean, um, and he had sex offender shit. 
where he had sexual assault. He did mad different shit. And the um the the person who got off um defense. Yeah, he got I feel like, like this isn't the same. I feel like this is what, completely different. No, because one, the crime is so egregious on the on the younger person's end, or like I'm trying to like extrapolate to the the um the the fuck my my bad. I think I think I understand where you're going with this. <laughs> the idea going, right? is like, that the you, crime you, is you so egregious going. that there should be a punishment for somebody who performs that action, even if they're yeah, like once you have all those you yeah you going to jail as a 17 year old with all those fucking yeah. illegal documents for like fucking forgery, bro, and like being doing something that not even adults could do. Like you're going to jail for something that 99% of the fucking populace. All right, can't I don't want this to be the Kim so fucking like, show. Do we have a second time? There's, there's, you know, you know, no, no, hold on, hold on. Also, wait, also, yeah, Vito's Vito's before, before, before real quick, oh yeah, yeah, God. yeah. Vito's good with the kid right, fucking. Right. He knows the question two is when can white people say the n word? So he wants to get to that topic, okay? Okay, I'm just kidding. Just real quick, just as a quick, I don't know. Wait, as a quick insertion, the reason why it's considered a strict liability offense is because in society we've decided that fucking minors is a bad thing, a very bad thing, and also that you don't want every single person that fucks a minor to go to court and be like, well, I really thought she was 18. And then every single case becomes that you've got to prove the fact that this guy knew that this person was underage, which is a really hard thing to do. And that's why it's a strict liability crime. Just as a heads up. Okay. Well, could, could you not make special because we're talking about no stop no, no, no stop irrelevant stop stop yeah but actually before before even this real quick before we move on to the next topic uh -oh. i just want to highlight the fact that we just spent like an hour pretty much talking about the hypothetical of a girl that's underage tricking a guy that's older we never even tried to think about it the other way around wait and that's i did where... my hypothetical was i was <laughs> okay, a 17 year old okay, 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 Listen, i saw that too i put that out there bro. no I'm, 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 I'm just saying i'm just saying uh, like i've seen plenty of cases around too where women and i don't know why it's like a fucking teacher had a train ran on her by a bunch of fucking 14 year olds whatever the fuck and everybody in the comments is like Damn, what were those teachers when I was yeah, growing up? Yeah, those boys are heroes. The... That's a totally different <laughs> see, situation. See, yeah. see, but that's fucking like, no, no, but that's crazy. No, 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 that's no crazy. I, as long I as the teacher was hot. So, okay, so you guys are cool with, like, hot girls being pedos. Just want to get that oh, one. No, no. no, 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 no. The boys but, are heroes. Yeah. The woman is a criminal. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Put her in when, jail. Like Maybe women can get away. No, women it's, di get it's away different with because you can fuck up a whole. Like if you got a teenage girl, you can fuck older men who are and men are all predatory. Can fuck up her entire life. Knock her up, brainwash her, keep her in a pumpkin shell, and keep Bro, her very what? well. Older women, you can't really, you can't really fuck up a, a seventeen year old uh, guy's life the same way you can fuck up a seventeen year old are girl's life. Serious? It's different. It's fucking different. Of course, it's what you about, can't have a yeah, kid I'm as a guy. guy. Yeah, of course, yeah, it's yeah, different. Yeah. It's you still predatory, but it's very Do different. You know that is a crazy thing. It is very different. They're not the same. You, you, Boys you, and you girls are not no the experience same. Thing. You don't got no fucking experience there. Emotionally, do you know how much damage it could do to a fucking teenage dude if you yeah, fucking the girl has that too, woman, but there's bro, also a physical who, element yeah, to the girls. The it's here, way bro. worse. I mean, it's it's way worse. Like, you bugging, bro. Like it's way worse. It's predatory, but it's way worse. No, you think dads hey do you think dads are sitting their boys down and saying, Now son, you gotta really be careful for these twenty eight year old women that wanna suck your <laughs> dick on. every day. That's not happening, you idiot. That's happening to teenage <laughs> Okay, hold on. God damn it. Fuck it me. Okay, let, let me let, let me allow me Real quick, okay. Okay. I have to, I have to, because I've got to, I've got to do the as a father thing, okay? Jesus, barely, <laughs> barely as a father, okay? But as a father, nonetheless, okay? Um, listen, okay? The idea, pa children look at parents or children look at teachers or adults as like authority figures that they have this implicit trust in. The idea that as cool and as awesome as it seems, and I feel that, okay, I'm a big coomer. The idea of I'm 14 years old being fucked by my amazingly hot fucking female teachers sounds like a cool idea as an adult. But when you're a kid, I imagine that could fuck your mind up in so many different ways. Like if it's a teacher and now you've got to go to them because you've got trouble on the playground or if some fucking drama happens or if you're getting bad grades, like even for a boy, I think they can fuck your head up really hardcore. No, I just think the point opinion. is that it's just easier to victimize young women than young, I think young boys are more prepared to hopefully get out of that situation. And a teacher, yeah, it's the relationship, it's the trauma. I don't, I don't think that's Oh, true, and actually, actually, let's be real, let's be real. The trauma, the real trauma here is, what's the worst that can happen if a girl gets raped, okay? 
she gets pregnant, gets an abortion. What's worse happens if a boy gets raped? The teacher gets pregnant. Now you're on the hook for 18 years. Yeah, yeah. Dick, did you think about <laughs> that? Can you imagine? Dick, you can, you imagine can you imagine? Can you imagine? Seventy percent of your fucking allowance going to child support? How <laughs> fucked is <laughs> your life? Yeah. Okay, you gotta yeah. take. No, no, it actually, did. no, no. Vito it actually did. Oh, hold on, hold on. Stop, Vito. There was What's a case chance? where a fucking underage guy oh, you know. was pretty much fucking great. I don't like to say dog word, but his teacher made her pregnant, or by somebody that's older than him, made her pregnant, and then like she was like, "I need child support," and then he had to pay. That so was it actually, a Sandler Sandler movie. Have to pay? Yep. It actually yeah. happened. Yes, legally too. He had to pay one hundred percent. What? I heard about, but is that is that true that he actually wait, had to pay? Yep. Wait, let's. I, wait, uh, wait, 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 wait. I, I, I was in a I recent situation. I, I was in a recent situation. I actually want this clarification. I bought. So I had sex with this woman unprotectedly, and I bought her a Plan B afterwards. She said verbatim, "I took the Plan B. I took it, Darius. I took the Plan B for you." Click, 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 okay. click. So, and then I was like, "Okay, you did it." And then later on in life, she says, "Oh, I had to get an abortion for our kid. If she would have had that kid, would I have to pay fucking a child support?" Even this. though, she, yeah, yeah, even course, though, even though she told me that she had a, yeah, she, she took doing, the fucking Plan yeah, B. Yeah, you better go make yeah, sure yeah, she you took that, Darius. Yeah. <laughs> That's why you put it in her milkshake without her knowing you. Darius, the real question is, are you guys trying to do it? Let's shove her down, down the out. stairs just to be sure. Also, she she murdered the, the baby. Economy. That's fucked up. Yeah. Why did you not just pull out, Darius? Darius, seriously? It's romantic to come in somebody. It's like nice. It's a good feeling. It's like oh, you're not. But you're not having. You're not. You're not having romance with this slut. You're just fucking her. So. I mean that's so true, bro. Like, on my mama, like, I didn't think about it at the time though. I was just like, I was like, uh, I watched a lot of uh, you know, fruit baskets. I think, I, think do it, I think doing it on her face. I watched is a lot of fruits baskets. Nah, so you nah. had to knock it I watched a lot of fruit. Give her a plan B. It's, gro it's like romantic, man. It's like a isekai uh, okay. anime shit, man. It's like was the abortion too was the abortion I romantic too? Yeah. I never watched abortion, abortion romantic. anime. Yeah. Uh, the the abortion uh, would be romantic if it happened, but I mean, like, regardless, you, uh, either way, I. What do you mean if it happened? happened? Did it not happen? Shut your bitch ass up, nigga. Uh, well, I'm you just, just said it happened. Like the I'm, fuck, I'm, and now I'm, you're I'm, thinking it's happen. I'm going on Snapchat and talking to 15 year olds about fruits baskets. I'm just, I, I'm just Get, saying. Oh, grow that, up! Stop this. It's not, it's not a grow you're up like, situation. Like, why are all these children messaging me? And then you're like, right, I watched dude. an isekai about it. Come on. I like, I like I like what it is. That's what you know, Darius. You're a piece of shit for bringing this up because this yeah, is yeah, exactly yeah, what we well. talked about. Yeah, right? yeah, 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 yeah. Are we doing me. the child support round? No, no, we're not. You're better not act like you're a fucking victim. Do we have a new question or something? I don't know. Wait, hold on. Wait, hold on. I'm getting triggered. 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 I'm Drink yourself into staying quiet for a relevant sake, Darius. You know what I mean? Because I don't know what Downing is talking about. Yeah, well, he yeah, just got yeah, triggered. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Right. You're a liar. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Abortion is satanic, okay? RFP to the baby. <laughs> okay, uh, moving on. Moving on. <laughs> Keep in mind that Karantos is a little bit loaded there. Do Muslims believe in Satan? He doesn't believe in abortion because they'd lose other child soldiers. I thought he was broke. <laughs> Listen, the earlier they come, the better. Pause! Okay. Hey, yo, wait, yo, wait. <laughs> no, what the fuck? What? What? Oh, what? Oh, no, 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 no. what the? I'll mute everybody. I'll mute everybody. Stop talking. Can we move on? Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, holy shit. Uh, nice question. Fun question. Uh, is Power World a ripoff of Pokemon? Shut the fuck up, bro. You want to talk about your abortion? Can we move on? Can we switch gears? Can we switch gears? Bro? Yeah, yeah. Listen, this show's okay, random. Okay, we can I'm do all talk. I'm gonna be for though. I played that game. I have to, I feel like did anyone here play Rust? We're not talking about Power World. Shut the fuck up. Let's talk about Child Support. No, we're not talking about Child Support. What's wrong with Power World? What's wrong with Power World? What the fuck? You know what? So I think I know where this question came from because one of Destiny's female How am I letting this guy talk over topics, and I told her that we should talk about AI art, and somehow it got to Power World. So I think the question should be: Is is AI art ethical? No, that's another question, you dickhead. No, oh. That's a much okay, better question. Prefer, you know, okay, okay, we'll do that question. Hold on, hold on. For the future, though. Here's a, here's a good question. Dino, 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 Are the Dino, existing Dino. child support laws fair <laughs> towards men? Yeah, let's ask Darius. You know what? You know, should we start by asking about? 
why is Turkey Tom given the script before? I know I'm triggered. Why is he given the questions before he's even on the show? I and don't know. Give him the script. Yeah, I what is that? I think, I, I, did, did, I, I think games like Power World, Rust, they're all fucking boring, and you have to force yourself to like them. They're good time sinks because you could just sit there and do nothing for hours. But I'd rather play Cookie Clicker, um, something, some like weird autistic game where I could just kind of like make a little army that kind We're of does stuff. Because you're questions. autistic and you're not having a social experience. Evil folks, so you, dude, you have Funko Pops in your room and you're calling me autistic. Kill yourself, you're dude. Like, straight. don't talk. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Do all the 15 year olds on Snapchat like to talk about Power World? Or no, they talk about Funko Pops. No, nope. oh, they, 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 they talk about Funko Pops. I, no, no, hold on, hold on. Stop. I gotta I gotta I gotta defend the Power World question. Show you it's my okay. it's a fine question. The Power World question was fine, okay? Sure. It's fine. It was fine. You okay. You know what? You know what? It's fine. I'll, I'll answer it. I'll answer it. It's a question of intellectual property. Intellectual property. If you've actually played Power about? World and you played Pokemon, it's like nothing like that game. It's like it's like a weird yeah. like Minecraft Rust he... type thing with like these Dude, little but... Minecraft ripoff characters. And I mean, people will say it's like intellectual property theft, but who cares about intellectual property anyway? It's I feel like the characters whatever. in that game also all look the fucking yeah, same. Actually, I, 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 I gotta say something that's Power God's World. honest. Fucking Pokemon needed some goddamn competition. That's what it yeah, fucking Pokemon needed. Got it's getting it's way too fucking complacent and stale. How World it, it needs some World more shit farming. to be able to keep it. Power World is farming the shit out of y'all. If anything, the only thing Power World is 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 feasting off is the culture that that Pokemon breed. But in actuality, there's absolutely nothing to do with Pokemon. No, all right, all right, all right. I'm gonna be I'm processing what you're saying. Game, it's way more like Velheim than it is anywhere close to Pokemon. If no, if okay, anything no, 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 no. that they did. Bro, you're if all they correct. did was guys, we're not gonna do around around where we talk about how great the world is. Oh, why don't we make the question? Is, is no, no, we're not doing we're not doing it. You know what? Okay, okay, you know what? Stop. Okay, 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 stop. I'll switch the question. I like the evil 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 Okay, evil legal thing. Shut up. Thank you. Yesterday. I think I think that power. Why are you talking? Scary. I knew the two niggas, and you want to bitch? Stop. Okay, it's still about power world, but kind of technically, right? So lots of people look down on AI art. This is the question, by the way. Lots of people look down on AI art and actively discourage people from supporting services or games that use AI art. Power world being one of them. In your opinion, is AI art real art? Also, should we regulate or ban AI for certain professions? To be Go clear, Quarantos, thanks to your you excellent should, research, how you, should, you would probably know that... Uh, wait, why are you fucking talking? I'm in the middle of a sentence, motherfucker, okay? Taze on day. Chill the fuck out, bro. Listen here, motherfucker. Now I'm coming at you. Oh, he lagged when he I'm said that. Oh, my oh, God. Bottle just right destroyed there. him with his mind. <laughs> <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit. Stop, nigga. The uh, worst team teammate. Is we have an AI team. team. I'm fucking spreading misinformation. Power World is not AI art. If they did anything, okay. they, like, the oh, director man. of the game is just somebody who did um uh, uh, AI art game. And he's a uh -oh. proponent of, for AI shit. Now, people like to try to say that like, it's AI art and some of the assets is derivative, extremely derivative. But, bro, to make a game is completely like has nothing to do. Like creativity is like one of the smallest aspects of what go into a game and what goes into a fun experience. Power War has kept made it possible to have a fucking exemplary fucking fun experience that yeah it may it may be derivative it may not be fun all that experience creative. dude it's like the yeah, same the thing as every other survivor right? building that's not the you question we're not matter, talking nigga, about power right. you can't have oh, fun that's on you bro okay power world in a real sense in a real like in a hundred percent real sense you like power you like Power World because it's like about Power World. Shut up. This, Shut you the like Power World because it's like it's like the Vita, what's their problem? It's like the no, Trump no, of no, video no, games, dude. We're talking it's about like, AI like, art. You know, That's you have like an NDA on fucking Power the World. World or the whole shit with the AI. Yeah, I do know. Like, if you're actually artists, that when digital art came out. Traditional artists had the same kind of fucking problems with it, with digital art when it first came out. Talking about plagiarism, talking about um, mimicking and stealing people's content. You know that, right? Like, I mean, if you understand the art industry, but it was not on this level. Of amount. Of course, I know it's, it's not. Because AI about, is revolutionary because AI is revolutionary, but it's the same. Okay, then the is the, the same. same. It's this. That's like saying the Civil War is the same thing as like a, a World War. It's like two different things. It could be different situations. Yeah, but how world Listen, not as a consumer, AI, right? Whatever the fuck brings me a product that I enjoy for cheaper and more reliably, 
I'm here for it. Based. Power World um, the Magic AI. Consumer, we're talking bro. about AI. We That's don't it. need to talk about Power, power World. Let's is like going to all AI. these, man. Like, it's just like shit. It's just like it's... You, all they did was just culturally appropriate fucking Pokemon and everybody salty and tight. That's it. Like all the designs. If actually, if you're an artist, you know that it's actually harder to make something that still looks good and looks like something else than it is to make something completely new on its own. So like the fact that they have designs that still look like a game and is actually likable, but it kind of still looks like Pokemon. It like, and how many fucking Pokemon ripoffs has been coming off over the last 20 to 30 years? Y'all niggas so is the cat. question like, about derivative works or is it about AI? Because okay, power so is not AI. AI. It's about AI art. Yes, it so to is. Clear, it, 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 you okay, does not have AI, AI art. Yes, I've said relevant that. Relevant to an AI discussion. Okay, Power World does not use AI art. The question is AI art is technology that uses other people's art. It collates it from the internet to make original artwork and puts it out there. A lot of artists are mad about this. They're mad about the fact that AI art basically makes it very easy to replace them because they're yep. because they're their art is replaceable, frankly. Asmund Gold got a lot of shit for a take recently where he said, honestly, you know, it doesn't really matter what the artist thinks of AI art. What matters is what the consumer thinks. And if the consumer is willing to buy a product that uses AI art technology, then who fucking then like like you can't convince the average person who has like bills and groceries to worry about to care about a fucking artist. Take, you can't take. convince yeah, that. Well, I'll be for with you. You guys know Susu JPG. I paid like five bucks to get free nudes on Tele. Where's my Telegram? I get to get like nudes of her AI drawn. She made it herself. She's she's using the AI model for herself just to give her own like naked photos out to the people for free. Not for free, but it's like cost a little bit. But it's like I think it's I think it's a fine bit. I think it's fine. I think, well, I think the, the issue oh, with AI okay, is okay, okay, training okay, but Darius, Darius, here's the question. In that case, in that closed circuit case, obviously this whatever porn star you follow, it. she's consenting. Okay, she's consenting to pictures of her or whatever to be put out there. What about like just you know a, a AI technology that uses random people's art that don't consent to it being? Is used this technically illegal? Are you, put, are you putting it's out a picture behind a paywall? On the internet okay, uh, we've commodity. already we've already as a culture banned those people from Twitter. Like the Taylor Swift shit that happened, all that shit's banned. I'm not off, talking the, about porn. We're talking yeah, about they just that artwork. Let's just, let's just talk in general. Like let's talk in general. Oh, let's like, talk in general. Get your mind out of the fire, gutter, you coomer. Well, uh, that's all I want to think about. But even that, like, we ban that stuff. We ban stuff that's like obviously blatant plagiarism. That's like or just like. Banned from it. Twitter, it's not banned but, like but, worldwide. But the it's not AI, AI, AI art is we not blatant plagiarism. It's not. It's more. Common. Wait, what but do you want? But it's, we, sh we shun it. We already shun it. We already as a group. What do you shun it? it? Do we? What is it? Yes, yes, we do. We do. Who no, shows it? Maybe they no, shut it on actually. Twitter, but Chad, no, GPT hold on, like, hold on, hold on, hold on. Darius, you want to ban certain AI art or all AI art? No, I love AI art, bro. Like, I'm well, then what are you talking about names. banning? You're saying you're saying <laughs> we banned it. What did we ban? I'm not saying I'm not saying ban. I'm saying we we not banned it, but we've publicly already like it's like um it's like a guy who's a sex offender, right? Like we've already publicly been like, okay, what? This guy's why is that are you talking about? Person. You're a retarded. No, person, no, that makes sense. No, you. you're not even listening no, to me. You can't keep yourself from flirting with sixteen-year-olds. No, no, no. I can't stop myself. That's why I said I've multiple times stopped myself. I've never been hooked. Um, I'm just saying that like multi we with AI stuff we as a there's as a social see, backlash. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Let me speak. Let me speak. Yeah, with like the Disney thing. Disney released this AI art shit that was like Mickey Mouse and all this shit. We all were like, oh, that's AI. That's weird shit. Weird fingers and all that shit. I mean, this, I mean, the Disney. thing is, we the you. point that Asmund support that is shit. making is like Twitter people in the Twitter echo chamber care, but that's not representative of the greater population. The average person, if you showed them that and told them it's AI art, they'd be like, oh, okay, it looks good. Wasn't there a yeah, boycott? The there was a, there was a, like, boycott, a writer boycott? Same, was it for like That's SNL? the same thing with anything. That's the same that, thing with anything. Did it you do for a Miss America writing? There was AI, there was a controversy, there was that like was a part boycott. of the WGA terms was they were trying to outlaw the use of AI in uh, written productions for film and but No, but that's, Yeah, yeah, but something the, like that. The, and there was the people average that person, you give them anything, the they AI. think well, it's obviously good. Obviously, writers are upset and artists are upset. That makes perfect yeah, well, sense. Because and artists if your income, right if your income relies well, on being a creative and technology exactly. exists yeah, to take over, you're going to be upset. You're so the question right, is... You're talking about the artist niggas are already sold out. Since when has the artist not been a commodity on the internet bro honestly these fucking tumblr artists like you said these twitter artists with they fucking dragon dildo fucking fan um communities that they do they, they yeah. really got way too much validation off the fucking internet honestly they're commodities Fuck their em. opinions don't fucking matter 
Fuck they should out be homeless. Learn to adapt. AI I is a goddamn fucking tool, bro. It's just a tool that they don't want to adapt to. Like I said, back I in agree. the day when motherfuckers had um digital, um traditional to digital, a lot of motherfuckers didn't want to move over and they didn't want to change their styles because they invested their egos and they invested their 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 artistic style and prowess into something already. And they thought that they could have a voice to stop people from moving. All oh, that shit is just ego, bro. Like the the like you're participating in a market that has more than to do than just your fucking artistic skill. And yes, the fucking director who tight because Marvel slapping can shut the fuck up, bro, because everybody's still gonna watch the Marvel movie, bro. And if you want to have a fucking artistic hey. piece that's a piece man, you can still put it out and people will still support you you just mad oh, that millions and millions of people all right fossil fossil ones it's, it's, all, it's, all it's all it's jealousy well yeah. we have copyright laws and ip laws to protect artists right like we decide that the, that's that that's that's why we're doing that it seems reasonable to have restrictions on selling ai that content mean? that was trained yeah. on that's a, too soon, a property man. that you don't own you i would also I mean? say that artists yeah. who you know right now there have been leaks that proved exactly which artists uh, their works were used to train these AI models. Yeah. I think those artists are absolutely entitled to some sort of revenue I or uh, royalty for the fact leaks. that these models leaks. were trained on their work. Okay, uh, hold on. Let me let's, let me let me let me let me insert let me insert a little bit of nuance in the conversation. Okay, so the issue sure. is people um, people wanted to go about this from an IP point of view, whereas they they wanted it originally the works were derivative, right? But you can't really do that because the AI is creating something that doesn't appear to be derivative. So instead, people focus on the data training sets. So the question is, what is the meaningful difference between an AI that trains on copyrighted data sets versus an individual person that learns how to draw based on copyrighted images? There, there isn't really one. And you can't, you can't really? copyright an art yep. style, can you? You can't copyright it's an art ego. style. No, you, you can't. can't copyright an art I mean, style, but let's be clear. The human it's brain ego. does not Bullshit. inject an art file and then restore it to memory. Yes, it like, does. The way but a computer but, 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 but like, it Tom, does. People have lost. Yes, like, people have lost else. style yeah, lawsuits. Like what we're you talking about. That's true. Nick is right. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold bro. There have been I'm style lawsuits, and Dick is right that there have yeah, been. Can you can you, you like describe that to me a little bit? Like so. Uh, I forget the ex I forget the song. It was recent, but a guy got sued by the estate because his song sounded too much. It had the same vibe as the previous song, and he got uh, found to be in violation of copyright infringement. Uh, I don't agree with the ruling. Ridiculous. But yeah. Yeah, it it kind of means at some point like we can't make any new music if you if you take it to the extreme. Um, also, I would want to be I would want to be like really clear that here. isn't technically people being sued for style copyrights. It's because they were trying to make the argument that the underlying music was similar enough that it they're making the argument that it was a derivative work that he basically copied lines of melody or copied rhythms or copied things exactly. I don't believe you can just copyright a whole style. No, you. Uh, I I'll go look up, or I'll, I don't know. I'll try to look up the case, but it was uh, it wasn't an exact copy, but it was close because you know music is just chords and then melody. Is it, on top is this, is this was the case that was uh, was it Paramore? Blurred line, Blurred lines. Is you you, yeah. you know what the whole shit is is that y'all uh, y'all think that we have like this system that if someone plagiarizes then instantaneously we shun them and actually we have a system where if you find a way to get away with plagiarism it's all fucking good it's, it's celebrated it's celebrated yeah right? yeah it, it, you don't even realize how many works that you love are, are is just stolen from people who just silent and don't got a platform i think it just matters whether or not anything. the final product is good and people like it and then people tend to not give a fuck if it's plagiarized Exactly. Yeah, Actually, like that's what we'll the, we, we are abandoning the concept of protecting market. people if we just let we AI run havoc that people. That's on bullshit. creative works. That's what I'm telling you. Which that's is bullshit. fine, but that's the that's a choice we're gonna have to make. Like we're not protecting anybody. Uh, they can train their data on anything, including shit they don't own. Uh, but you're gonna be there's just gonna be ripoffs on an industrial scale at that point, which I don't I know think there is, is good. a uh, there is a lawsuit against is it open AI for Wall Street Journal for training other shit? Probably. Well, there, I yeah. believe there is. There have been some artists who have said, "Look, you plug my name in, and it spits out an image, and I can literally take like elements of the image and overlay them onto my own art, and it's a one for to one." So it's like, you it's know, like this a section of the is painting. It, is it, is it, yeah, it's kind of like a collage yeah, sometimes. Of is it? Is it? Is it? Is it uh, 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 you know, AI is not that, bro. Like isn't again, you're just listening AI? to somebody who's in your face, somebody who's you see, really who's getting, who's getting. I'm pretty sure 
But don't you think morally, okay, look, let's say it's it's legal to take these people's work and feed it into your computer and make a billion dollars. Because let's be clear, all these AI companies are about to become rich as shit. Shouldn't morally we as a society say, look, uh, you need to compensate these people. The only reason this program exists is because of the creativity that sprung from their brain. Uh, no. Give them a royalty, pay them a licensing fee to feed their works into your machine. I think no. we as a society can it, can adjust the laws to say you can't the just take you their like work. Right now is going through massive layoffs. Artists is getting fucking swatted out the fucking sky. You know how much and you, you want more of them to anime. For you know payment? how many anime artists is struggling and starving, nigga, and they are is getting so your argument. Is are, less of are, them should get paid? What is your argument? I'm saying I'm being a realist. I'm not saying less of them should get paid. I'm an artist, my goddamn self. I was do I, am I, do I feel bad for the artists or not? Money. The ones who are getting laid off. Should I feel bad for them? You don't know you shouldn't. They because no, they, I should feel bad for people getting laid job. off. No, no, Bro. you shouldn't. No, I don't you know, want to live. Like, in I don't think it's fair to say that you can feel bad for them, but also recognize. Well, he's saying not to feel bad for them because this is the future. Okay. We spit it all into a computer in the, the, the spirit of the present. That's what I'm saying. It's not the future; it's the present. Bro. I think just obviously. Can I ask? Know I, can, can, can I ask one? Can I ask one question? Compensated. Here's here's something I'm curious about, right? So, for the people that are pro uh, restricting the data training sets, where you're saying that you shouldn't be able to train it on copyrighted stuff, okay? Let's say that I have a, a third generation of like animated cartoons, okay? that are all cool and these artists were all inspired by like second generation animations and then we go all the way back to like first generation animations okay from like 100 or 200 years ago. i don't know when the first animations were what if you were to take an ai thing train it on that until it basically generated the second generation animations and then trained that on that and just basically reconstructed like human animations you've caught up to where we were how would you ever like enforce or regulate that sort of data training well, you'd have to prove all this in court. Like, if you did yeah. get taken to court for your cartoon, you'd have to, pr you know, your defense would be, uh, look, we proved, we we trained it on this, that trained it on this, and then the judge might say, you know, depending on where we land is, well, you can't do that. That's illegal. You owe them money. Um, which I would be okay with that because I think the system artists, right now is heavily weighted towards artists. these giant entertainment uh, conglomerates, and I don't like that. Like, I don't like that all of our culture is created by Disney. Uh, and I think there, I think there are laws in place, financial laws that have that have made that an inevitability. So I don't the mind. Your team may just say that our stuff is bait is there because the artist. Which one is it? Is it because the artist put the art out and make all our shit, or is it because the yes? Com, but the, the corporate entities that run the corporations that run entertainment uh, are are monolithic. I I don't like that. I th I think it's had a disastrous effect it's on some our culture. Bullshit, bro. Like the artists, the artists wouldn't even get it in front of you in the first place without these without these corporate mongoose who's just fucking I don't think that's bro. I'm not gonna just I accept can, that I think I don't accept that art doesn't exist without really, you I don't accept that art doesn't that. exist unless Disney is publishing it okay I, I art think, has existed yeah. in the public sphere well before these corporate monoliths They've come along they and they've. I mean, we were just talking about Power World. And they were owned by like a multi-billion dollar company. Wait, give me one era in this world. Wait, okay. okay. hold on. Okay. Also, okay. also, 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 let all the niggas jump in. Okay, let all the niggas jump in. Also, Disney artists yeah, don't get paid bad. billions. The CEO does. Disney artists don't get paid billions of dollars. There's no artist making billions of dollars. That's what I'm saying. At any time in history, for human history, ever, when has the artist been making billions of dollars off their work? And when has well, it been? Banks, I guess I guess like a, certain, a lot of famous artists who have made good money. Damien Hurst, like are like manga like, artists. How much? Like, how much pretty... does like Hidoa Kojima make? A good I'm amount. A, I mean, he owns the company. A fucking gig. Yeah, I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, that's that. I mean, nigga. probably is it, is a lot. It is that nigga. Nigga. I mean, well, I mean, I mean, hold on. You also, do you think the balance between artist and and go ahead? Sorry, Disney sorry. used Isn't to be owned by Walt Disney. Walt Disney was an animator. So I have no problem when the artists at the top are making tons of money. Walt Disney made a fortune, and he was an artist. Okay, so you can't say, oh, the artists never get paid. And also yes, you're saying, you don't, you, you you don't... It's an anomaly, bro. This, well, like I said, one of the richest men nigga. alive. What are you talking about? I'm the president, nigga. How many artists starve and die, nigga? Like, every, a lot. everybody got... All right, then. Majority a lot of people start to agree die, that the vast majority artists. of artists who are making the content that we consume are not being paid multiple millions of dollars. Dude, now, Walt Disney, true. 
Not even yeah. close. If anything, they're being underpaid. Like the struggle with the artists is that it is right. So let's have some laws uh, in favor of the underpaid. artists, right? That's all yeah, I'm saying. saying. Like in the balance of between artists and like con uh, conglomerates that that sell their art, I would like to see more uh, laws coming uh, weighing in favor of the artists. How or, are you uh, saying uh, artists, artists are underpaid them. and also they're a bunch of pretentious fucks and we shouldn't feel bad when they lose their jobs? It's You're arguing two artists. lanes. Yeah, because they artists. Pick what one. You mean? So they're artists, they and that's just so the they way they deserve to starve and die. Do they deserve more or less? Do they deserve, more, do they deserve more or less? Do artists Bro, if you deserve the artists more? They probably gonna Hold stop on. doing art. Oh. <laughs> if you give them like, more, they, they, they don't want to make art anymore. They gotta we, have to star, we have to start. We have to start. How do we stop bro. later, Let lady ballers? That's all I want to know. How do we yeah, never we have another lady, lady ballers? ballers. I think so. Here, here's like a question. That's what happens when artists have money. Yeah, yeah, so here, here's a here, question question for so keep them broke, broke, and you'll get what you want. Because there are point. content, we get a lot of content creators on this panel, right? So here's a question. Um, I, I think one argument that somebody might uh, forward is the idea that these mega corporations are important because art today to produce at a high quality, and even arguably in the past, takes a lot of capital, takes a lot of initial investment. And without anybody there to make those types of investments, you would get a lot of stuff that just wouldn't exist. So for example, when we look at a lot of like classical music, like Mozart and stuff, like a lot of these people were court composers. Their pieces were commissioned by kings. They weren't just writing in the passion of their upstairs, you know, bedroom or apartment. They were literally being paid like huge amounts of money by, you know, royalty to compose these songs. And then today, if you wanted to animate something, uh, like unless you're willing to sit for two years and work on one project, you probably need like a team of people and everything to do it. And who's going to front the capital risk for that? If it isn't like large corporations, I guess, how do you like deal with that? Well, I mean, that ties back into the AI art thing and why I'm pretty for it. It makes it more accessible to be able to do those things because now I don't need a whole animation team. I can instead go to chat GPT 4. Point, whatever the fuck, 5 million point oh, and then I can be able to do this a lot more accessibly. Or if I want to have individual people make my art, I can. I can choose to do that. If that's I also think I think it's I, I think it's important to make a distinction that I don't think that uh all AI art is all just fair game. I mean, if what you're making is essentially in its essence a complete rip off of someone else, I think that, you know, there should be legal avenues to explore to, you know, take care of that. But I think the AI art technology as a tool for artists is quite cool. And I think that a lot of the artists that are throwing hissy fits over the very existence of it are just uh you know, probably yeah, they're retarded. making a hundred they're, they're probably making a hundred dollars a month drawing furry art anyway and should be replaced, honestly. <laughs> yeah. I'm okay if I agree that it, it does take a huge budget to make some of these movies, and I'm okay with increasing the budget a little more to be giving like some sort of licensing, like a training licensing fee. Uh, I, I want to protect the individual, the human element of this, and more than I want to protect the, the corporations uh, need to make profit off of it, I guess I'm saying. And there is a sort of a, a precedent for this because algorithms in and of themselves are defined legally where uh, a, comp a process becomes too complicated to be done by a human and then it becomes an algorithm on a computer and that has its own legal classification, I think. I don't know, I'm not a lawyer. Uh, so I, I feel like we're, we're, we're able to conceptualize these things in different stages uh, like we should do with AI. We have to hope that AI, it's gonna be like, you know, the invention of computer animation. It wasn't that we lost jobs because we had this new technology. It's that people became trained in the new jobs and that there was more demand for it and thus more movies can be made with that technology. Yeah. So I have to hope that AI isn't, oh, now we can make movies with less people. I hope it's, oh, we can make more movies or more elaborate movies. Uh, and yeah. that, that should be the focus is finding ways to expand and find these people. Uh, I do think artists need to stop being resistant to it. I think you need to go, okay, AI is part of, it's the future. We've seen what it can do. It's very powerful. And I think artists need to stop uh, with this wish fulfillment of, oh, is, you know, we'll socially stop it. We'll convince everyone it's bad. It's never going to work, okay? Because as we've said, the layman does not care. The layman won't even know that it's AI at a certain point. So I we mean, need to embrace it. We need to implement it into people's workflow. And artists uh, yeah. should be excited about it, but they're going to have to figure out how to use it. With every new technology, there's always growing pains. There may be a few lost jobs, but I mean, one decent example of something that's a lot more um, widespread is uh, paper. When computers became a big thing, laptops became a big thing, everybody assumed paper would like basically just die, right? Who the fuck uses paper, right? I don't know if you guys know, paper sales are like up 15% from like pre-laptop mm. era because now that printers and computers are just so accessible, every school is using like a retarded amount of fucking paper. And it just expanded that market. Now they're making more money than ever. And this is going to apply for animation too. If animation and art is more accessible, if the barrier of entry for skill level is lower and you can more easily produce things, um, I think it's just going to breed more and more beautiful art 
uh, and I think Vito is going to be at the forefront of that. He'll be helming it, and he'll make some really great uh, above-age sex. Fifteen-year-old dragon like one of the most on an adventure. It's got what an ID. What are you doing? It generates an ID for your. Uh, uh, yeah, we're going to generate Lolly. fake IDs for all the kids. <laughs> Yo, I know, uh, I know it sounds like I know it sounds like I'm I'm being a downer about artists and everything, but again, as an artist, I actually do think that a renaissance is upon us. Again, I just think the artist is just being hissy fits in their egos, and they just been high off of being able to have like a ten thousand Twitter follower support, you know, Patreon or whatever, join Dag Dragon dildos and shit. But the thing is, is that if AR that. Art you comes in, that? hold on, this is the thing is, if yeah. AR art comes in. Um, and let's say everything gets homog homogenized and like most of the AAA things or the higher production things become like kind of samey, but people generally like it. What now opens up is a niche market for more artists to just take on their own endeavors. And honestly, people in, in times like this are willing to pay more for something that's more individualized that they- Nigga, I, do not, I actually don't care, dude. I'm, I've tried so hard to listen to the conversation, nigga. It is so boring, dude. Evil Fossil, it just sounds like you're <laughs> mad because you're a shit tier artist that makes yeah, no guapo you and nigga, you're mad because AI, you nigga, Again, you what spam, do you do? No, I'm not spamming shit, shit, nigga. I'm just, I'm just processing this. I'm thinking, no, I'm processing what you're saying and I'm thinking about who you are, who are those people? You what don't know who the fuck I am. You're parasocial fucking parasite, nigga. What the fuck are you talking about? Who I am, nigga? You don't know shit. He was you like, know, what the you fuck? Don't know shit, nigga. Who is that? SMC, nigga. I don't know. Do they have IDs? <laughs> we would love to see. Uh, hey, did you guys vote for the end of uh, hey the end of the round, guys? Congratulations. Here you go. Vote to kick, not keep. Here you go. Boom, boom, boom. Okay, sorry. No, no, just, I will I'm processing what you're saying, and I'm thinking about everything. And honestly, God, I zoomed out, zoomed out like when? 75 percent of it. Don't win. Oh, you didn't listen. <laughs> How are you listening? You zoned out, nigga. Shut up. You I think you don't make sense, bro. I get it. You really bored, nigga. I get it. I get it. Honestly, I would make more niggas than you. The only thing they really provide is art, nigga. So if I'm not sitting here arting, nigga, then you ain't gonna care. I get it. I'm just saying, bro. Let's if I took go. your art, put it in an AI machine, I'd make it ten times better. Make a, make more guap, make more money That's than fine. you. Make this That's fine. That's definitely fine, nigga. I'm, but I'm but guess what? Yeah, yeah I'm but just, that GPT is gonna say, have Fossil, you're safe though because, because an AI not. can never say the N word. That's true. true. Exactly. That's the N word. Exactly. There's gonna be a huge exactly. market for so racist when, art. So when you racist make this art shit better, future. and somebody wants to have gore. Sorry, I said the opposite. We vote to keep, not kick. If you can't read it, fuck you. You don't deserve to vote red anyway. Vote to keep, not kick. The AI machine doesn't produce gore. They're going to come to me, nigga. And I'm going to give it to them. The blood and guts. That's, a, that's exactly what's going to happen. So All that's artists should learn to draw fucking... really racist stuff because the AI exactly. isn't allowed yes. to make it. Also, just as a real yes. quick, as a, this thing comes in, okay, for people thinking that it's going to help, like, naturally drawn art or whatever bullshit, that's not going to happen, okay? Because you guys nah, are leaving not, out, you're yeah. forgetting the crucial element in terms of people deciding on what to buy, and that is price. The thing about AI is that it's going to allow you to create stuff incredibly cheaply. So for that authentic art that you want, it's going to cost you like 10 or 50 times more, which is why people that do art as humans are dog, a little bit more threatened a, by it. Dog, in a real sense, dude, you're saying like, oh yeah, if it's not going to make gore. Once it makes gore, what do you do? You look for the next thing. You're going to hope that there's going to be unique niche things for the rest of your life that AI can't take over. And eventually you're going to run out, brother. And then when that, when that time oh, runs yeah. out, you're gonna be out of a fucking I'm gonna job. Die before that it runs out. is very. That is very prescient is because your time has run out, Darius, and irrelevant. Exactly. No, I'm, a, I'm a real nigga. Oh, oh, wow. wow. oh, wow. wow. oh. Yeah. Thank you for coming on on irrelevant and Darius. Please shut yourself out. Last words. Darius, get on Snapchat uh, before bedtime of all these. Yeah. Stories. Go find you yourself soon, a girl to take home. <laughs> I just want to say before uh, you guys yeah. leave, someone, yeah. someone, someone, someone named Just Elk sent me a picture of you guys sitting in a room with someone named Callie on the screen holding a fish. And uh, well, it says what? she's twenty, but have you guys seen this picture? You guys know what I'm talking about? <laughs> no, I'm, I'm, no, Just I'm Elk sent you. Yeah. A... Take a seat, type two. Is that okay? Is that he sent you a picture? I don't know. Just Milk sent you. What do you say? Just Elk. Me he sent me a. You allowed it says to have five, eight. Women love me, fish fear me. I mean, I'm allowed to have it, but it looks like a pretty dark image, dude. It looks pretty Just dark. Just put, put it as your background. I'd love to see it. Bro. <laughs> yeah, what yeah, is this? No, no. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, put the picture up. What the fuck is this yeah, picture? Put the picture. You want me to send? I can send it to you, Q, if you want, okay? Uh, yeah, send it to me. I'll put it up. Okay, let me message you. 
<clears throat> okay. Irrelevant. Uh, well, any, yeah. Darius, anyway, shut yourself out. I am. Uh, Wait, oh, it says dog. Oh, no, 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 no. I just, I saw the image, bro. Before like, they know, oh, before they leave, before they leave, we need to see the picture first. It wouldn't even let me send it. I'm am I gonna go to jail if I see this? <laughs> Don't put the picture up. What You're is not gonna it? go to jail. It's just there's something. Wait, let me add you. Let me add you. That girl's probably. She could. Come on, she could be 18. It's possible. Shut your bitch. I want to see that ID. I want to see that ID. She okay, Kira, did you add me? Yeah, I sent you a request. Okay. I feel like the really tight, like, life vest kind of, like, makes her boobs smaller than they oh, actually are. You, what is this fucking so picture? Just this is AI generated, right? This freak. is AI Where generated. Where is this picture? Whoa. <laughs> what the fuck is this shit? Yeah. That's what ben. I said! She was oh, sent is this real? Uh, I don't know! Video. I will tell you in oh, two no seconds shit. if it's real. It's, it's real. It is real. It is you real. have to show it now. You have to no. show it. <laughs> okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'll send it's it in real? the... I... Wait, yeah, send it in with the... With the match, bro. Honest to God, there's people like baby alien fucking, like... OnlyFans models on fucking uh on Okay, I sent now. it in the chat like, in the How are we supposed to how are you even supposed to know these days? <laughs> what's that? What's that about? The fuck was that shit? What was Darius, uh... you, you got you got any comments? It's, it's you... in the chat. Hey, it's in the, it's in the server chat. It's in the server chat. It's in the server chat. Do you want Darius, to be like... Why is there a message of you saying hi? Do you want to hang with me and talk about life? I want to be honest. I mean, like, obviously, that's like one of the photos of like eight, and she had the photo of her as a kid on there, and someone decided to screenshot it. It's not real. Was that obviously. the one that made you want to message her or something? I don't know. Like. No, I was just like, I was just, I was trying to figure, I was trying to figure out, I was trying to figure out if that was her baby or not. I was trying to figure out if that was her as a baby or if that was her child. What's the lie, nigga? What do you mean lie? You were there. I was there. I was what? there. Yeah, look at his eyes. Look at him. Look at him. Look at him. I'm side eyeing you because I just sure made a weird joke about her. I probably made a weird joke, yeah, because it was funny at the time, but I didn't want to fuck a child. That's obviously a child. It's I don't a baby. know, man. Your eyes are, like, way too intrigued by that picture. Yeah. I'm intrigued by the fact that someone has a photo of this. That's what I'm intrigued That's by. That's intriguing to you? Why is that intriguing uh, to you? I don't find that intriguing. <laughs> what is intriguing to you about children? Well, so interesting well he about literally already shit. said it. He said <laughs> he <laughs> wanted to know if it was his daughter. <laughs> 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 See you guys later. Have a good one. Take care, Have fun, man. <laughs> Okay. Congratulations, Please. by the way, for making it to the last round of Kicker Keep. You are the Thank four you. finalists, the last two teams remaining. Now, if I win, do I get to say the N-word? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you know what? I'll, I'll give you the ER you pass. Say it bro. All right, cool. All right. There you go. There you go. Now, let me ask you this. Wait, hold on. I'm sorry. Wait. Have we exclusively eliminated black people from the show so far? No, we got, oh. we got Fossil. We got Fossil. fossil. There. No, no, I mean like of all the I, 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 Okay, I'm so sorry. Hold on. I forgot Q English is not your first language. Well, that's actually true. It's not your first language. I asked if we've exclusively eliminated black people. As in have the How only people that have Darius? been eliminated been black. You just kicked that was out the Darius. How black is Darius? Let me think. Yeah, also, by the, way, that, the, the way you framed the question, it could be taken both ways, but yeah, we eliminated Darius, Irrelevant, Sky Tech. Actually, that is what the fuck? I don't think this is racist. This is DGG, so you know what? Yeah, so the, fossil, you need to win. You need to win for the black yeah, boys. That's all I'm saying. Which I'm not a part of. We by kept the one know. Mexican around. That's pretty good, That's right? Pretty good. I can't breathe. I can't breathe. Wait, who's a Mexican in here? I'm half. Dick. I'm 51%. Wow. Come on, Q. Wait, wait. So you're 51%. Your name is yeah. Dick Masterson, and you look like this. Uh, Q, that's you know, not my real name. <laughs> Wait, really? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if that's the a it, 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 that's I don't know. Masterson <laughs> seems like. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah. Is Quantorius your real name? <laughs> Listen, Masterson sounds like an actual real name. You know what I mean? Right. That's you know why I got the name? Danny Trejo spots here. It's on my line. Also, also, before b before I move on to the last topic, I just want to quick quick shout out to uh, Ilhan Omar. You know what I mean? The Congresswoman. Uh, she had a she had a base take recently where she pretty much said that she's in the U.S. government just to you know be a voice for the Somali government. That was based. I appreciate her. You know what I mean? I thought she was a sellout to the white devil, but she actually wasn't. So I apologize. Shout out to you. Anyways, moving on to the last topic. Multiple topics since we've got 30 minutes. Recently, Keffels. I don't know if you guys know who Keffels is. Do I need to introduce that person or is everybody familiar with them? We got it. You don't know who? We yeah, did you know. briefly. Wait, is that... I, I believe yeah, you, actually. I'm fucking you know, right. Let me move on. No, no, I believe you. Uh, Keffels had the notorious, the infamous, the one and only... Chris Chan on her stream recently. How far is it too far when it comes to platforming somebody on your channel? 
by the way, uh, Christian being the guy raped his no, transgender woman. Young lady. They raped her mom. Zer. And, and, right? and, 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 and look like young about that. Like raping your mom isn't really a crime. Like It's I your mean, mom. Oh. Yeah, it's your mom. Who made you do it? Society? Uh, you know what? You know what? She had all the I'm chances actually, in the world. You joking, but I'm dead ass gonna I'm I'm gonna play devil's advocate. So I'm throwing the what? game. I'm sorry, Tom son, but I'm I'm Chris Chang defense force right now, son. If y'all motherfuckers don't know how long the internet has been harassing and completely just devastating and destroying that person's life, y'all niggas is bugging out, bro. She had no that she had no choice wild. but to rape her mother after all that harassment. I don't, yeah, really, I, agree I, don't really, I don't really you guys are all being very funny. I don't really care to defend Chris, but I think it's fine if Kepos wants to interview someone who did something bad. I don't I don't really care. I will say I think I saw a little bit of the interview and I wish Kevels had given more pushback rather than just being like, I'm so glad you're back. Oh my god. But I mean, whatever, I don't know. It's her channel. She can do what she wants. She'll get Yeah, I mean the news goes to prisons and interviews criminals all the time. Uh, we have plenty of documentaries about people who've committed horrible rapes and murders. Uh, so I don't know why there is all this expectation, this idea of platforming that you can't have people who have been uh, accused of horrible things. You can't talk to them on the internet. And I think okay, obviously we want Vito. to hear from Christian. Yeah. We want to know what happened. I mean, you're literally, you're literally like talking to. There are I'm three people actually, in this call who had Mr. Girl on their shows like a hundred times. So obviously, this yeah, is, uh, kind yeah, of and we've got this, Vito this here now. So you know. I mean, yeah, I mean, horrible, the crazy right. shit. The crazy shit is how much. Like, I, you know, who is it? Some, some dude from Mars. I forget his fucking YouTube channel. This motherfucker yeah, released a gamer five from Mars. Hour, oh, yeah, yeah, a five-hour video a documentary on Christian. I actually sat through that shit and listened to all of the shit that that fucking person has been through with the internet and like this autistic individual who's le legitimately, like, clinically autistic was abused to no end on the internet and is the most one of the most documented fucking entities on the internet like i, I and do you think a, do you think okay, okay, if, you want, where if you want to go down that path of thought do you not think they can be held accountable for fucking their mom he's your teammate like, by the way that, that, see that's a that's a complete like bro i think that is that's almost like well, that's like if you like like if someone's in the fucking psych ward and they like bugging the fuck out for like consistently five months straight and then you lock them in a room with their moms and then they fucking kill their moms and you'd be like god damn we need to lock them up it's like you you almost was fucking asking for it like there's so much more precedent that something bad was going to happen in that person's life that no i don't think that f from the internet point of view that we should be looking at that situation and then saying the worst so here's a few, aspect of that whole thing as, is the as, fact that as someone who Chris knows a lot of, their mom okay as someone who knows a lot about chris let me give you a little context for years, Chris had been writing in their in their little writings and blog posts about their ideations about having sex with their mother and how there wasn't anything really wrong with it and how they had a dream of fucking their mom. Pre the internet suggesting anything about this, they had ideations in their mind to do it. I know there were like, you know, Isabella Janky, like some degenerate Discord trolls in there trying to encourage them to do it and encouraging it. But I mean, obviously, to an extent, if somebody is doing that out in society, whether or not we think that they can be held totally mentally responsible, don't you think this person should be in some kind of home? Do we have no, Cyrus Chan being at home? Put her in? Yeah, I, I, yeah maybe, I'm yeah, miscom prison. maybe I'm miscommunicating. I'm not saying that this person is not should be held accountable for what they did. But you just said it yourself. Like, there was how a plethora of blog posts about this situation and the fact that Christian, there's so many instances where that person did things and people were like, there's no way they're going to do it. There's no way. Like there was one instance where they, where they catfished them and, and he drove like fucking three States to meet somebody. And like, mm. they was like, there's no way they're going to fucking, th there's no way that Christian is going to get in the car and fucking drive three fucking states, three, four fucking states. And their parents was going crazy because Christian just fucking vanished out of nowhere. When it was like internet fucking trolls baiting them to, to leave their home. Oh, fossil, fossil, their, fossil, their... fossil, hold on. Yeah. I, I want to ask you guys this. I want to ask you guys this because Vito kept talking about, you know, I don't know why the fuck we make a big deal out of platforming. Who gives this shit? We could talk to whoever as long as we're not co-signing them or supporting them, whatever the fuck, right? If I were to bring up Christian right now from AVC and put her in. See, I said her, I'm progressive. And put that nigga in, right? Would you guys feel comfortable with it? Would you guys feel comfortable no. with it?
No, I no, don't, I don't I even like that. Don't, don't give me that bullshit. Don't, don't give me, yeah, they don't give me that bullshit. Of, and we should platform anybody, but I wouldn't be around them. You know what I mean? No, okay, we have to fight for platforming no. now. We have no. Right. Now it's important to protect everything because that's what they're trying to take away. If everything was perfect, Q, and you and you could platform anybody without losing your bank account or your life or your career and shit, then I would then I would be willing to say how uncomfortable it is. But, but you're not we're platforming in the situation we're in. Q, 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 shut up, shut up. To be clear, that's a fault. That's a, that's a, that, that doesn't even make fucking sense because we're defending people's right to have them on their platform, but also that's also the right to choose whether or not you have them on. I would feel uncomfortable if Chris was here. Other people, I would think you should clear it with the panel. I mean, that's the thing is everybody should have the right to choose who they associate with. We agree with that. You wouldn't want and to. And Dick is right. There us. are there are there are people like Fuentes or you know Alex Jones or whatever who have had their bank accounts shut down and had their lives. I mean. You know, partially man as a result of speaking their mind. Alex so Jones is back on Twitter, to, uh, and it's taken it power from him. him. Like he seems less interesting and cool and powerful. You can like watch his. I think you can watch his influence kind of erode because he's no longer this folk hero for freedom. And I, well, I love not that the guy. Mystique anymore, yeah, yeah. Um, oh, Tom. He, everyone can see when he fucks. So up So that's now. an argument against deplatforming because honestly, when you deplatform people, you do kind of give them this mystique, uh, and you make them into a victim. I mean, you know, the the idea of having your voice taken away, not being able to defend yourself, not have your ideas heard, I think that's uh, genuinely horrifying to most people, if not all people. And uh, instinctively, we all identify with that. Even if it's the worst person in the world, the idea that they can't speak or defend themselves uh, online or in a court or whatever else uh, is horrifying. So the argument against deplatforming is I just think it's highly unethical that all people, even the worst of us, should be allowed to plead our case. Even if our case is insane, even if Chris Chan comes on here and goes, I should be able to fuck my mom. I go, well, you're fucking nuts, but I'm not going to take away your ability to express your ideas. Bro, what, uh, does, what does being clinically, like, you do realize that ever since the beginning of the true Chris Chan saga, this person has been, like, diagnosed by, like, whatever institutions you want to say. Like, they get paid by the government for being mentally inept they're disabled like, they get disabled. what does it mean to y'all is that nothing is that nothing well, we don't does have anywhere to put her are you saying it's have big beautiful institutions can you, can you, can can you not have autistic people? people on your stream no but i'm but but i think karate is here right now like, <laughs> uh, what you got okay. Autistic people, okay okay first of all first of all oh. no 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 fossil one second fossil one second oh. i want to talk about this uh-oh no, tom, tom i'm not i'm not going i'm not going to go in on you because you know what even if i was autistic w autism that's all i gotta say but think about it this way does autism make you want to fucking rape your mother because you you brought it up fossil you're yeah. like it's an autistic person that was abused normal to want to fuck your mom you, i thought you, that you, was you normal behavior was Oedipus, man <laughs> yeah kids like there was a video of an autistic kid she was like the moms was telling her no papas today and he was like Popeyes! And he grabbed her and was like fucking choking her. Like I don't know if any somebody had to see that fucking video. I guess y'all know, but the I've never seen that. Can you find that for research purposes? Is that <laughs> at, at some point I'll show you? But the, the like autistic children, they actually can get violent, bro. Like it's yeah. I just don't understand Look, how you just like. We all agree autistic like people just... are creeps and weirdos. We know that, but I'm not going to take away their ability to. Maybe you we know, should put him in the platforms. UFC. Yes, uh, uh, Sam Hyde should take before. fish tank and just make it a whole. I'm not just the fan of raping We wouldn't have fish tank without our been locked away a long time ago. Exactly. But my point is that the internet and we are the internet right now has been dealing with this person for over eight years with consistent behavior and blogs. It's almost like if it was if it was a fucking school shooter instead, and niggas is like, yo, there was like fucking forum posts all day of school shooting and nobody did anything about it. And then when it happened, you condemn the fucking person. But what and am all, I supposed all, to do? when an autistic person makes a comic book about them hanging out with Sonic and trying to fuck women. I can't not talk you're about meeting. that. You're meeting. You're, meeting. And I might even want you're a degenerate, bro. Disengage, son. How long are you going to form it? Eight when there's a guy who exclusively it? commissions artwork of women cutting down trees and buying Wonder Bread, yeah, that's naturally intriguing to me, and we want to bring him on the show and talk to him and find out what's going on. How old was her saying, mom? You want to ignore it and, like, we're not allowed to talk about it? It's not... Bro, I'm saying that you're, like, right now, you're condemning this person. Even if you wanted to talk about it, you're not... Like, the moral... Like, like the side you're taking right now is... It's, it's fucking... To me, it's cognitive dissonance, bro. I don't what understand do you mean? how niggas... Why? What do you mean? What do you mean? Be like that. Sorry, again, this entire time... 
you know all this law about Chris Chan, but every time you try to have any sort of empathy, you fucking start memeing. But like at the same time, you're trying to act like you can have some kind of fucking morals like standing. I think. I don't think. Can, not can you have Can you have empathy for someone while also making fun of them? Yeah, you Look, can. I, I, definitely, but there's a limit to the shit. Like I, I love the what, internet too. But what is I the limit? We're, we're we weren't in Chris's DMs saying go fuck your mom. We're just talking about it on a podcast. You do know and that you, there's we, like people who went to his crib. Like they went. In yes, I know they went to his crib. Yes, that's wild. Nah, that's All crazy. Right, that's so let me ask you this. Let me ask you this, this question. I'm someone, I don't All want right. Christian to come to harm. I don't want to encourage Christian to harm anyone. But I do find it interesting that they make these crazy comics about the exonic characters fucking women or whatever. What am I supposed to do? Just not comment on it because it might lead someone else to harm them? Like, just ignore it. Don't talk about it. Don't post about it. Is that my moral responsibility you to that person? You still keep framing it. You still keep framing it as if this person hasn't been driven over, like, over the edge to the Pretend point it's where, not like, them. Okay, let's pretend it's a completely different person. There ain't nobody on the internet who's, who's had their fucking lives fucking siphoned by the internet to such a degree, bro. So you're like, saying morally they, because of what's happened to Chris Chan, we should never parents, talk bro. about Chris Chan again. We, 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 we morally... Keep this fucking crazy-ass extrapolation. It's called a What do you want us to do, though? What do we do? What do you want us to do? What do we do? If you're gonna do, keep doing what you're doing, but realize that you we just started off talking about... Okay. No, listen. No, we're starting off condemning this person as a rapist. Like, you're painting yeah. Chris Chan. If Chris Chan... What do you mean, yeah? Like you, well, you like you're a rapist. Rape. What do you want? Yeah, what do you mean? I can't say Chris what? Chan is a potential rapist. <laughs> did the rape happen? Well, no they did the rape. Russell, Russell. 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 reality, bro. I can't. Also, you might you might see it. I really don't want to lose this. I want this five hundred dollars. Can you please explain I, what the point I, of what you're saying is? The point of what I'm saying is like the framing of anything that involves with Christian is already warped beyond measure with memes with 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 context that's outside of that person's life so for you to assess whether or not they they should be held accountable to the rape or whatever people are bringing them on the internet for again is 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 just doing the same thing over and over again bro it's, do you think christian's a danger to herself and others huh do you of think she's dangerous they... Yeah, Even okay. Dangerous. So what should we can we lock her up for the rape? I mean, what are we gonna what are we gonna do about this? You should have been locked up. So what I'm saying is you should have been locked up. Wait, stop, no, no, so fossil, 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 fossil. They had to commit a crime. Okay, 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 okay. One second. Fossil, stop, fossil, stop, stop, stop. Let me switch gears a little bit. I want to switch gears. So should we start wait, said, should we start locking up low cows just because they are no, annoying no, 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 no. on the off chance they rape their mom? <laughs> You I guys mean, said lock, lock, lock no, no, Vito. Stop. Right, you said right. lock them up. You said lock them up. You said lock uh fucking Christian lock up. Lock Christian up. Where would you lock them up? In the men's prison where somebody like oh. this motherfucker raped they got their mother or the women's prison? How about we go there? Let me ask you this. Where would you lock them up? No, no, hold on, fossil, fossil, stop. There's a lot of moms to rape stop, in stop. women's prison. Ooh, okay, no. It, it's a woman. It doesn't matter whether it's a mom or not. Stop trying to fuck. There are actually a lot of moms in there, kind of, probably. Yeah. So where would you lock them up? Where would you? Give me your take on that. I want to know. Dick, I'm talking to you. Yeah, oh, to lock this, you want to lock them up? We need a, we need a whole fucking, we, we got to have asylums back. This is just like. Engaging with accountability over the Christian situation at the point of raping of mom. That shit is wild to me. The fact that it's only it took y'all until he raped You're his Dodging mom. the question. Before, where do we. You I'm can't arrest him. someone who hasn't committed where a crime. Where do we put Christian right now? Yeah, true. Don't dodge. Bro, I'm not no fucking psychiatrist, bro. Fuck out of here, son. But the, I think well, then, the what is the point? We're having for... a hypothetical They've conversation. Been in the home for Give me a an long idea. Time. They've been in the home. Oh, no. All right, lock them in the fucking home, bro. Lock all right. them in their Just own lock home. them in the house like Chernobyl. Dump you some in all over. You want to lock them in the house? You know what? You know what, Fosso? You know what, Fosso? I actually agree. I actually, I, I see your point. Yes, Chris should have been in a home prior. But because there was no crime committed, because of a lot of failures of the state and various systems, because of the fact he was coddled by his parents, he was not in a home. He was in a position where he could do something very retarded and fuck his mom. That's unfortunate. But there was nothing, there was there was no reality in which Chris would have actually been in a home before going to jail. Like, there's no reality in which that would have actually happened. A lot of societal parameters would have had to happen. And then, and ultimately, like, what reality do you expect to happen? Like, a bunch of trolls online are, like, calling the police like hey this person is drawing son at you i think you need to put them in jail 
Like, this is a platforming question, ultimately, you, right? You, you mean the Sonic Chew instead of, yo, this person, like, we, we fucking, like, all the I other think, things that have been done, but Chris, all right? Like, but Chris hadn't done into Chris, your house. Chris hadn't done anything illegal until the mom thing. Yeah, they haven't done anything illegal, but they did things that's unhinged by anybody's social standards. But you can be un- but just because you they are unhinged doesn't their mean you can go to jail. At risk. Like y'all worried about getting doxxed. And again, they had like multiple teams of content creators come under the guise of being friends to farm. So them in okay, their okay. House. So so whose responsibility should it have been to deal with that? Me? Yeah. No, what I'm saying Turkey is that view. right now we're we're still trying to assign moral responsibility to Kefu's for the way that they're platforming or handling this person under the guise of them being a rapist. Okay, listen, here this is an easy question. This is an easy question. This is an easy question. What is the law that you would draft? What would be what would become illegal or what would become punishable by you know criminal offense? The law <laughs> that I'll draft is um man, son. Like first off, I thought doxing and you know, harassment and um, all that kind of shit should have already been illegal. If that stuff, was none illegal, of those things are illegal. Think, when you say illegal, so if I, I DM you, not, uh, man, but you that should be illegal. If I, I DM that, you a mean word, you, I, you should arrest can me. Can be illegal. It can reach that point. Yeah, I think, but not I mean, not in the internet there's, sense. There's if you're like showing up and stalking somebody and harassing like, somebody in real life, yeah. But. You, know, you think I don't know what Encyclopedia Dramatica is, bro? That page should be illegal, bro. Christian uh, Encyclopedia Dramatica should be illegal. I will take Encyclopedia Dramatica from y'all niggas there. Do you know how hard you're... You're going to have a bad time if you're trying to do that, man. You will have everybody fighting for that. This is all to protect somebody who should be in an institution. We need to we need to bring institutions back. Uh, someone like Christian should have been identified early. You can take him in for a psych evaluation. Give him a limited time. Like, I mean, we need to bring back One Flew Over the Cuckoo's Nest and just try to make it a little better. Uh, Cause what we have here is Kiwi Farms, and it's, like we're a, we're a violent society. We we see violence and we we profit off it. We want to see it. We're 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 very sick people. We want to parade it around and laugh at it and judge it. Like it's very important to us. So we need the law to come in and say and we don't want to we don't want to cross the law's responsibility and the platforming responsibility. We want to let us be sick and degenerate and parade around freaks, but the law needs to come in and protect them. And that's the component we're missing right now with Christian. They should have came in and said, you need to be a ward of the state. We're going to run you through a bunch of processes and take a look at you, but we need to protect you from this very sick population that will never leave you alone. I mean, you can't outlaw... Chris Chris, Chris also need to be protected from themselves is, I think, the greater point, too. Because I think even without the internet, because of the abuse they suffered in childhood... A lot of horrible things happen to them. Their their brain degenerated to whatever degree, and they just they they're not fit to be out on the streets. You know, they're not. I'll say this: Look, not. if you're bringing on Chris Chan to try and hurt them, to try and uh, humiliate them, uh, to a certain extent, I could find that immoral. But you can't, uh, you know, outlaw human curiosity. Again, when when there's a person and they do wacky things, they make crazy comics. Okay, my brain goes. I kind of want to learn more about this person. Oh, hey, there's oh, an encyclopedia dramatic yeah. article. Like, I mean, to what catch are you gonna, a predator what are you gonna do with all Vito, Here's the thing, Vito. I, I, How are you going to stop people from being interested you, in that? The thing is, is like, there's a difference between if you did this shit to Boogie right now and you did it to, to Christian. Wait, why does like, Boogie, Boogie, why is it okay to do it to Boogie? Because Boogie all, deserves it. Well, yeah, but it. why does Christian <laughs> not deserve it? Every, <laughs> every bit. Of it, bro. He's a fucking degenerate. He's the worst. Christian just, just, raped just his mom. <laughs> I mean, that's <laughs> you see what I'm saying. You can no, make an argument like that's worse of than Boogie being a piece abuse, of shit. Bro. You've been a no, get the fuck out yeah, of here, bro. Yeah, but mentally he's, sick people can also be bad. Yeah, yeah, fossil, 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 fossil. 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 Here's, here's a good question, yeah. fossil. Okay, so with Boogie, what would you say his worst traits are? Boogie, um, ungrateful. He fucking all, like he's awful. Like he's fucking privileged rape? out the ass. Um, and do you think? Just, do you think he's greedy? Do you, do you think like, that any of his and, any of his negative tendencies could have been formed due to the abuse he suffered in childhood? Are you aware he claims to have been molested by his own father? He claims. I, I, like I ain't listening to a goddamn thing that man says. Okay, let's say it's real. Let's say it's actually real. Would that absolve him of responsibility in the same way that Chris is absolved? No, because he's still not like <laughs> clinic. Like I, I believe in society. I believe in our institutions. What if him That's being so- molested made him retarded? 
Bro, yeah, then he would have a fucking. He gotta give me the the, the, the retard degree. He pull it out. He'd be like, "Here, I'm right. clinically retarded." All right, and I'll be like, "All right, maybe I'll give you a little leeway." Okay, we need There's to protect like retards. That. I mean, is that it? So I'm, I'm, but the, I get where you're going with this, but the thing is, like, again, um, Christian has <laughs> has all of that, like, in in fucking writing, bro. Like, he he was a mentally unstable he couldn't be in like regular school doing mad shit like he already had that before he ever been in locale Even yeah but you can't stop the, us the, from making inception. fun of him the, I, then we I can't mean, make fun can't. of anybody then boogie's fucked up because he got jacked off by his dad like there's no I, end to then we're just going to be sitting then Vito is there's some for some reason we can't make fun of Vito like where does this end we can't make yeah, fun I, of you know, him guys it? I have a condition are you the government giving this nigga money bro he's clean are, I mean, you, my dad raped me clinical. that's why I'm fat you're not allowed to make fun of me for it <laughs> see you can't give shit, people bro. a shield a 28 like year that. old woman raped me when I was 14 yeah. 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 Fuck yeah. Up. fuck out of here son this motherfucker was a millionaire son he has mad Oh my God! So if Christian made a million dollars through crypto, bro. then we can make fun no, of Christian. No, but it's different. No, it's different okay. because he he ran a business, or at least he was able to make something that no autistic person could legitimately just engage with. Um, so we're gonna outlaw. Like, hold on, we're gonna outlaw Encyclopedia Dramatica. You've said that, oof. okay? Now are yeah, we banning? We so are we saying Keffels can't have Chris Chan on? No show should have Chris Chan on. It is irresponsible no. to platform this person. Would you okay, do you, you think do you on. think it's irresponsible in like a like a civil, like just person to person sense? Do you think it should be like illegal? I think I think it's um like first off, I'll start it with being taboo, like hard body. Especially, do you think it should like, be do you I, think I do you think it should be illegal yeah. though? Illegal, and taboo is great like, marketing to me, too. Even with like legality, I don't prescribe morals to legal. That's the legal system. I'm not like I'm not somebody who'd be like because it's illegal you shouldn't do it, or I'm not somebody who'd be like because it's illegal you shouldn't. But like, but if it, if don't, like do, if I don't think legal, anybody. Should, I don't, okay. Yeah, I think we're all in agreement on that. Okay, all right. Everyone can determine their own moral code. Uh, but you're saying if you were given the powers, let me say I made you judge, jury, and executioner of the entire world. Okay, the laws you want to implement are. If someone has autism or some sort of mental disability or trauma of some sort that makes them a little uh, not so, don't comment on them, don't highlight them, don't don't spotlight them. I mean, what you're asking for it seems it, it's crazy. Do I don't know what, 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 what you expect. Don't question the statement, me. All right, don't question the statement, me. You you're gonna ask me a question. I'm the arbiter. At that point, I am I going to ask you a question. Like we, the internet is still young, okay? If if you internet's are young. diagnosed with mental illness or like you mm, actually not as young paid, as Boogie's girlfriend. Anyway. <laughs> <laughs> if you get paid and like your life is sustained by the government and the people around you are taking care of you, I think that there should be something in place. Like if you engage on the internet, just like children, some we have things in place to stop children from engaging in dangerous fucking spaces. We should have something Wait, that we stops do? people with fucking mental Kind of. Where? That little button that says, are you over 18? Click the button. Click the button. <laughs> I, I'm damn sure been exploiting not, I, I, that Ryan's I, World kid for decades okay. now, man. Kids are more exploited than I don't know if that ever. works, Vassal. Why am I, I, I allowed I to make endless play. videos of kids opening fucking cranimals or whatever the fuck, but I can't put Chris Chan on to talk about his stupid Sonic comic? So you're you not asking, talking about you're you're literally putting him off your rate. Can you stop memeing back to the to the fucking comments, son? Right? No, we can't. We can't stop memeing. That's yeah, the point. I want to talk about Zonachu, exactly. no. and if the rape comes up, the rape comes up. I mean, what do you want me to do? A guy who wears a Pikachu medallion raped his mom, and you're telling me I can't find that funny. You're like, that, I can't believe you would find it funny that a man in a Hand yeah, it wasn't my mom. Medallion. I don't, I don't just, care. Fuck his think elderly mom. No, Vito, please what do you answer want me, to me do? this. Yeah. What I want you to do is answer me this. Would your outlook on Sonic um, on Christian and Chris all Chan. of the situation would be the same if the Sonic Two comic didn't exist and the history of him being a fucking locale didn't exist? Do you think you would have the same point of view what about it, the situation? Funny. It's yes. less would funny if he's really not wearing the medallion, but it's still kind of funny. You it would be funny for Kefus to bring on Chris Chan for raping his mom. 
if he if he if he I think it would be Chris a, it okay look and yes obviously account. Chris Chan is an interesting figure no we don't need to every person who commits a rape does not need time on YouTube to talk about it but obviously Chris Chan is an interesting figure has been followed for years and yeah it's a matter of Public curiosity. People are. I mean, we watch serial curious. killer documentaries. Like there's uh, a shitload of those. No, yeah, I know more say, about Jeffrey Dahmer. Jeffrey Dahmer was fucking insane. Yeah. Does Netflix Did have a Sonic about, okay. Two series lined up? Jeffrey Dahmer was definitely mentally insane. Okay, and then he kidnapped a bunch of guys and he raped the shit out of them and killed them. And you're telling me, like, don't go to the jail and interview him because he's a victim because he was victimized or whatever else, right? What's the difference? Oh man, it's so easy, bro. I, I tried to bring up the boogie shit because I know both of us would sit there and laugh the shit out of boogie if he was in this fucking situation. <laughs> like, no, but I, wait, honestly, let me say are, there's a public I mean, interest in the platforming now, sickos because it helps people learn to recognize identify sickos. sickos. Yeah, yeah. There's a there is a public interest in getting the most sick deranged evil people giving them a platform no, because then everyone can learn from it or maybe learn that's from the it. to be clear the okay can't but tell the difference dick dick if we're being honest that's not i mean that's a very sort of sugar-coated rosy way of seeing it i think a lot of people just are like get off just, on it just like watching people suffer yeah i don't think it's yeah. that kind of i don't think it's like oh I'm but gonna it's satisfying though like women watch murder porn and they get off on it because of all these different things and one of them I, is like i can maybe i can more identify sickos if i watch this like i, look, I think it's very hard to say it's one i think or the that's other. i think that's what they think but i don't think that's real well, look <laughs> I think you guys say here, here's, here's, a, here's a question to guy this i'm curious okay you all agree that like if you go to a heavy metal concert and there's a mosh pit or whatever in the middle that that's an okay thing right or do we think that's unethical even though people maybe might get hurt maybe not well yeah, when you fine. when you when you enter Everyone the pit you, you basically side a social contract yeah i agree yeah, yeah. so there, there are certain things that we can do where some people can get hurt maybe maybe not they kind of consent to it when they go i think that the internet because the internet exists has elevated these platforms in ways that we never really even thought possible so instead of just like mosh pits we're getting like you're all familiar with the term like crowd crush and when you look at like people that are sure. stuck in these huge crowds that end up getting crushed to death and killed, it's hard to blame on, Travis, any one individual for why somebody got killed. And it's even a little bit hard to take accountability for the crowd. Like, should the crowd be blamed? Um, I think there just needs to be like more awareness, right? About like what's going on because it seems like a lost cause to try to because so, like what are the rules that are that are trying to be written here for um, you know like for evil fossil? Like, should the rule be you're not allowed to talk about law cows ever? And then you might say, well, what you can talk about them, but it's just that they're not that famous. But then if you talk about them not that famous, then they become famous. Well, did you commit an error there? Or like, I, like I'm just curious what the rules are that any of you guys would write that are trying to say this shouldn't happen. Like, what, what rule could you ever write here that would protect or cover? I would Alzheimer's? not write any rule. I think right now it's pretty much perfect. I don't. I, I don't think, think I, Fossil is arguing that doxing should be illegal. Uh, for some reason, Encyclopedia Dramatica should be illegal. I'd like to focus on that. Like, what what do you think? What is wrong with Encyclopedia Dramatica? Like publishing the information yeah, is. I not do have a problem okay. with the porn that's out there of Christian because it's like it's, it's, it's like what do you man? What do can you, you call consent it vigilantism, to that? But it's not even like it's like a it's it's a degenerate fucking um it's like degenerate fucking what do you call that shit with community police shit? It's like degenerate neighborhood watch. That's Encyclopedia Dramatica, bro. But my whole thing is just that. Again, but can, can, can people I'm, can people I'm, I'm not a, post? Like I don't understand. What is your you particular can, issue with ED? I, I, yo, I maybe I really did fuck up, bro. And if we lose because of this shit, I'm sorry, bro, <laughs> nigga. I got <laughs> five hundred two niggas. Five hundred You're going long. against free speech, fossil. What I mean, you took a you took a bad tag. You took a bad tag. Don't want to engage listen, the fact fossil, that this fossil, person fossil, was listen, like. Listen, listen, ex, listen, ex, listen. Ex, if right, we do no, lose. If we do lose, there's one kind of apology you can give me. One kind of oh, thing you yeah, can I, gift me. I'm gonna need one pass for this stream. Oh my god, <laughs> Okay, that gets no the awareness. awareness. No no awareness. awareness. <laughs> okay, okay, Turkey, you just threw because now people want to see you say the <laughs> word. Then you're gonna lose a pass. <laughs> I'm gonna say it if I win. I'm gonna say it if I win. No, he's saying it either way. If I lose, it either way. If I lose, I'm saving it for rainy day. If I win, I'm dropping it right here. No, no, no. Oh, on. No. oh no, no, no. Uh, if I bro, win, I'll say it twice. I was, so there you Leo, go. Bro. I was born in this shit too, bro. Yeah, I get I it. So I, I would love to see people just... I, I, I do engage in watching the dilapidation of people's minds too, bro. It's great. 
I think it's fine. Going back to two girls, one cup, you watch a bunch of poor Brazilian women get tricked into eating shit for money. It was fake. It was fake. The video was fake. Regardless. Unlucky. But those women are never going to live it down, I'm sure. I'm sure in their home state, they're publicly humiliated. I'd be disappointed if it turned out Boogie was lying about getting jacked off of his dad, too. (laughs) The cornerstone of the internet is, yes, there's an element of public spectacle, public humiliation. We want to see public freakouts. We want to see freaks. It is a freak show. And uh, look, sometimes it goes too far. I think there are people who have been like, ooh, and Chris Chan, I'm going to, you know, trick him into doing horrible things. Or like that guy who got tricked into eating his own shit. There's like a bunch of stories like that where you go, guys, uh, don't go that far. Uh, But I do think that uh, Evil Fossil has thrown this round by being like, and never talk about them ever. And it's like, bro, you're just asking for. Stop fucking. Stop doing that, bro. Stop doing it. It's not like, I said there should be some. Lo- some there should sort be of some acknowledgement of someone's mental state right. if they got when you establish the chart they of how much are they're clinically assigned a mental like like bro we don't put them in a fucking public school because they could trip out and because a public school is too stressful for an autistic kid so why would we put them on a public internet it's the same shit like you yeah, literally okay. have a, a special bus because a school this special that's government. amazing so and speaking of that special them. bus we are voting on the final poll. Good luck, guys. Good luck to oh, all of you. Oh, shit. God. Make your oh, case, shit. people. Make your case. Why do you think oh. you should be the winner? Go ahead. Here we go. Well, uh, I don't think that we should have to care around. about Chris Chan or his mom. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> I, I think, think if you really, Fossil, have mom, you sent Chris ahead. Chan's mom a, a, an I'm sorry card or a sorry you got raped or something like that? You're up here <laughs> pretending to be better than us, but have you really done anything? No, I doubt it. Mm-hmm. How much Damn money straight. did you donate to the Raped by Autistics Fund? Yeah, I the Raped by Autistics Fund. All my EBT. All, all your EBT that's goes why, to That's it. why I vote for me, all right? Because I definitely need them bones, okay? And I will, and maybe I'll give like a dollar or two to Kessels. Guys, we can know. all agree. We can all agree that uh, pursuing, you know, minors, uh, underage women is uh, is atrocious, horrible, and no one should be doing it. We're all trying to stop it, but we should get as close to 18 as possible, right? I just want to say everyone on this panel, I'm sure, can agree with that, right? Dick, why are you trying to throw the round at the last <laughs> Shut up about the kids. <laughs> Running this poll for one more minute is very close. Poll if you uh, vote oh if you feel God. strongly, guys. This is the guys. legendary N-word poll. <laughs> yeah, it's the N-word poll. I already said it, and I didn't even hold the audience hostage. Watch Kicker Coop cool. episode, what was it, 26? Well, that's that. Come on, son. You acting like that. You trying to take my power from me, bro? Let me get uh, no, I would never. I would never take a black man's power. I respect you too Thank much, you. Eagle Fossil. Thank you. Look, regardless of who too. wins, uh, I think an autistic <laughs> guy in a Pikachu medallion <laughs> raping he his is. mom. Kind of funny. <laughs> Something to talk about. Twenty-five Wait, seconds. Is it a close one? Let, let's see. Twenty-two is it a close seconds. One? Yeah, I'm just waiting for the poll to run out, or I'm waiting for the time to go. Twenty seconds. Okay, it's very close. Within Where is 15... Christian now? Dude, get to voting the now, ladies and gentlemen. Get to voting. Yeah, we did. Did Kessels well, address the trans mean, stuff either? Persecuted. Uh, I don't, what y'all I don't do with the Kessels? All right, I'm listen, guys. All four of you fought hard. I'm proud of all of you. Okay, congratulations, oh, guys. But unfortunately, <laughs> Evil Fossil and Turkey Tom, you guys have lost. I'm so sorry. No. Oh! Oh my we God. Stop it, Stop it, baby. Oh, we all win. Shit. We get an N-word pass. Tom, you win. get an N-word pass. Wins. You get an N-word pass. You get an N-word pass. You get an N-word pass. Say it together. Fuck it. On three, oh, everybody. Man. N-words hey, across America. Give us America. I like it. <laughs> I'm actually okay Not. with this result. I'm actually okay I'm, with this. And, and there's a reason I'm why, you know. Me and Vito oh, have had a lot of disagreements over time. We really have. We've argued a lot. We've had a lot of beef. Would you agree, Vito? We, we've gone back and forth, okay? Have we? Yeah, sure. Of course. We have a little bit. And I think you really gave your all. I typed this up on a notepad so you can tell how important You this typed is. up on it. You got all statement prepared. Listen, Vito, you, get, you gave your all on this stream. You really did. And I, and I know you have a lot of problems, okay? There's a Thank lot. You. You're fat. Yep. You're gay. You're on Ozempic. That's not a problem. Your mom had sex with me. And you're probably yeah. a pedo. Oh, Probably. shit. <laughs> but no matter what happens, Vito, you'll always be my nigga. Oh, what the oh, fuck? Oh, it did it. You'll say it. Holy shit. Respect. Oh, respect for nice. actual saying it, though. Wow. Uh, Evil Fossil, Fossil, how do we find you, buddy? Where do we find you? Explosive ending, guys. You find me Cozy Fossil, actually, because on Twitch and Kick. 
playing the game. Yes, I'm playing Power World. Shit comfy as fuck. All right. But y'all got me being here, being evil on YouTube. You can find me at Evil Fossil. And I do make some kind of commentary videos. Um, it was pretty nice being here. I enjoyed um, the conversations. And even though I didn't expect to have that amoral goon ass motherfucker on my team, he did pretty good. I, I like you guys. <laughs> yeah. the time, right? Like, and I was, we was kind of going at each other, but it was all in good faith. And, uh, Listen, W yeah. team, W team, W team. W W. Thanks. Also, it was, an inter- it was an interesting strategy to constantly <laughs> argue with your teammate, but uh, it got you to the finals. So, what are you gonna do? Uh, I had to right, make there the we go. With the with the uh, Thank you, th- thank you for coming on, Evil. Yeah, right, man. Lady, y'all. Uh, take care, guys. Congratulations for being the winners of episode twenty-six of Kicker Key. It, 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 listen, thank this you. show, show, it, it's an honor. Honestly, it might be a life achievement, but. I have a twist, and hear me out. Uh-oh. We've never no. had two. No, 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 hear me out. Hear me out. Hear me out. It's All up right. to you. It's up to you, right? With the platforming, you, you can choose with the platform, not the, whatever, right? So hear me out. We don't usually do two winners, and I know Little Steve upped it to five hundred each. It was meant to be two fifty each, but you know what I mean. Little Steve added the extra. But here's the thing: if you guys choose to, you could play Split of Steel and take one K. Now, if you would like to, you can split it 500 500. But if you play Splinter Steel, one of you wins and the other one loses. Would you like to play? Like, we got to argue another topic? No, you don't got to argue. You just play Splinter Steel. We'll give you one minute. You guys no, decide. Hold on, to listen. I, no, I, I, they're fucking no, best friends. Agreeing. These no, guys are the best guys. friends. I, I, no, they're already going to split it, bro. No, no, every time I go to their fucking podcast, it takes them 20 no minutes options. to come upstairs. They've both have been sucking each other off in their little gay <laughs> fucking <laughs> studio. <laughs> okay, for 20 no, fucking no, minutes. No, no. All right? No, There's no way that these two men that share semen between each other won't share a $1,000 prize, okay? No, no, no. When I say share, you got to understand. Already, as it is right now, they're splitting 500 each. If they decide to choose split, it just goes to what it originally was. But if one of them decides to choose to choose steel, the other loses. It's up to you whether you want to play or not, guys. I mean, I'm not forcing your hand here. I choose steel. But... No, you fucking retard. That's not how it works. <laughs> what does that mean? No, that's not no, how it works. No matter what, I will choose steel. All right. Guys, have we started? Have we started? Listen. We're... Guys, are you in? Yes yeah. or no? I'm going to choose You're steel, in. and I will give you the $500 next time I see you. What happens if we ju- both choose steel? You got one minute, by the way. What if we both choose, choose steel? steel? Do we not get then, anything? We get nothing? get nothing? Nothing. It's up to you. Oh, All right, well, Vito, you are not trustworthy. You have not gotten on the scale. You promised you would get on the scale for 50 bucks. I will choose steel. I'm way more trustworthy than you, you fucker. 100% I am choosing steel. I- I'm choosing steel. I'm way... <laughs> 100% I am going to choose steel. I'm telling you that now, and after the show, I will give you half, because that's fair. Okay. All right, fine. All right, we ready to go? Yeah. Wait, you ready to go? Okay, decisions have been made. On the count of three, I want you both to if say- If we both choose we... steel, we get nothing, Dick. And I'm You get nothing. Steel, you get so nothing. Don't choose steel. You get nothing. I, mean, I don't know. <laughs> don't you ready? choose steel, because we will I... get nothing. Are you ready? Yeah, I'm, I'm ready. ready. Three, two, one. Split. Go. Split. You fucking retards, bro. Good Why work, would you Dick. do that? Good work. Why you would you do you that? that game. That's the you only way you play it. You get an extra. Always do honestly, that. You honestly, always do honestly, that. honestly, it could have been fun if I said you get an extra 1K. If I said an extra 1K. Yeah, you need to make it more. Yeah, you got to think yeah, about have... this, you fucking <laughs> Okay, 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 okay. Let's see. Let's see. Do we no, just we make it like one more time? It's over. Good game. Good job, Vito. You're the host. biggest problem in the universe. Get the fuck out of here. You're going to love Biggest Problem Friday with me night. and Dick. Check it out on YouTube every Friday. I am on kick at kick.com slash veto comedy. Going to play a little pal world. Uh, guys, great show. <laughs> a lot of fun. Uh, we beat all the other pedophiles to prove that we are the number one pedophiles on kick. Oh. And that's the yep. bottom line. Great. Thanks, guys. Uh, Dick.show. Thank you. Patreon.com slash Dick. Thanks for coming on. See you Friday. Thanks, Destiny. Thanks, Q. Biggest Problem. Thank Go there right now. Way. Subscribe. YouTube. All right. Take Bye. care. Bye. You fucking dickhead, Lucy. Why are you why are you trying to cut my content right there? Oh. Like, are these guys suck each other off? I don't care. What if one of them felt like they didn't want to suck the other guy off today? Maybe. What, and then we're not we're really not gonna give them their money if they both choose steal. Bro, I know you're like a multi-trillionaire, but holy shit, save the 1k once every while. What the fuck? Jeez. Like you need to think about it. Ah, this, I get to save this 1k this week. Nice.
Like, you, that never crossed their mind. Okay, whatever. See, I was trying to look out, but fuck it. I guess, I guess you got it like that, whatever. But God forbid Q asked for maybe a six month bonus, then you fuck you, nigga, get back to the fucking field before I whoop you. It is what it is. Anyways, what's your thoughts on this episode? Uh, I thought it was cute. I don't know. If, did these guys choose their teammates or did you assign them? I assigned them randomly. Oh. Uh, not randomly. Not I mean, randomly, I knew Dick no. and Vito. I think, yeah, I just assigned them together. Mm -hmm. It was meant to be Tom and uh, Vegan, but Vegan didn't oh, get that close. Fuck. But I like, yeah, that would have been way better. Yeah, but but I like I like Fossil. He did great. Yeah, oh, nothing against Fossil, but Tom and I think Tom and uh, Vegan have like a friendship history. Yeah, they got. Yeah, that that was the. That's why I had Darius, Irrelevant, Vito, and Dick. It was fun. It was fun. Honestly, top three episode. I'm not gonna lie. Top yeah. three episode.